Who's ready to talk toys? What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Yimbo and welcome back to my channel Yimbo Reviews Everything and this is my Sunday Night Podcast where we talk about life and toys. For those of you celebrating, I hope you had a fantastic Easter. Ooh, I always get that bit, it's that big pause like right before we jump into the show where it's like, ooh man, yes, I am on spring break. I feel like I just talked on the internet recently. Oh wait, I did last night. <laughs> And today was a fun-filled day of family and driving all over the state of New Jersey, but it was so worth it. And um, yeah, it was a good day. It was a good day. Ultimately, it was a good day. So how I hope you guys did too. I wish you all the very best. I hope you had an awesome uh, day yourselves, again, regardless of whether or not you were celebrating the, the Easter season. Um, but we got some friends in the chat already, so let's say hello. What's going on, Turtles Nerd 88 uh just a shout out to you man because like you've been doing a lot of great work with those rage um the not I, I, is it rage i guess they're still technically rage right i don't even know i just literally paid this is where i'm getting to uh 5k sent out the um email for second payment of the not donnie and the not splinter and the accessory pack so i did that when i got home tonight so yeah i I stuck with them because they are really awesome and you know shout out to toy mirth i know he uh was able to showcase those figures early so good on you anthony and um yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna roll with them now i don't know if that means i'm going to be tracking a lot of the holothon stuff down <sighs> i mean i did go on friday and i looked at my what I, what used to be my toy haven target and it was all the old stuff you know the usual things so i ended up um i don't know i'm leaving stuff to the hunt i haven't made any executive decisions but the fact you know i'm gonna i'm gonna stick with the, the the not the not team because they're really neat i really like again that's a sweet interpretation and um i really love my not leo and you know just his level of articulation um not that i wanted to like push him too hard you know in certain areas but you know he's like he's a lot of fun so um yeah i'm definitely sticking with that line but anyway i thought you'd get a kick out of it because i know uh, that not leo is one of your one of your favorites so whoop, hold on anyone need to jump ahead why it's myth what's going on conversate collectibles how you doing buddy uh again fantastic month of march uh with your mini mate stuff man um you know i I was bad in terms of the photography aspect, but, um, you know, just being able to hype them and get the, get the word out on how great they are. I do have a set somewhere. Oh, here we go. So tonight I might end up unboxing. We've done this before, but we might end up unboxing the daredevil woman without fear set. So this one's really crazy. I also have the last Ronin one. I still need to get to, um, you know, I like to space these out because, again, they're just, they're a lot of fun. They're super cute. Give me, you know, so yeah, tonight, I don't know. I think tonight will be the night to unbox and showcase those. Um, Move it on. We got my man, Cal the Collector. What's going on, Carlos? Uh, Cal and I, this week, we have to pick a day. I still have to, like, finalize editing my shop, but he was working on, um, speaking of, Diamond uh, Select. Uh, we were both working on a Marvel Select Hulk collab, so... Yeah, I'm, I'm I'm excited. I have a picture. I may or may not now that I'm on spring break. Put a little more, you know, lighting and stuff into it. But I kind of dig what I what I first sent him. But um, I just want to try some edits on it and everything. But anyway, so that's something to look forward to. So Carlos, I know I'm looking forward to it, buddy. So thanks for joining tonight. Um, Clint Tassik's in the house. What's going on, Clint? Uh, man, I. I could still keep talking about X-Men, which we probably will. Oh, yeah, because we're going to talk about this guy tonight. Hey-oh! <laughs> so we are going to continue to talk about X-Men. 
um but as again a shout out it was on uh we cross streamed it so it's been up on my channel all day today so again not pretending you guys see every last thing that i post or do but last night um i got to hang out with uh the between two sentinels they had on me and toy father and then henrock 112 joined us uh to talk about episode three and uh it's really exciting because machu had it was a great idea and it's something that, you know, like he's going to be the, the primary, like, you know, it'll be through between two sensitals. And I do plan on making literally as many of these episodes as possible. But yeah, like a weekly recap. And it's just another cool way to, you know, stream and hang out with you guys. And, uh, you know, it leads us into the road to Comic Con for San Diego with uh, it's going to be so much fun. So what's going on, man? Uh, messy toy photography. What's going on, Messy Man McKinney? How you doing, brother? Um, so yeah, what's up? What's up? Oh, and speaking of the Rabbit Man himself, <laughs> Rabbit Stand Collectibles. How you doing, Marco? Good to see you, buddy. Uh, you took a great shot today with um, Captain Carrot, and so did Toy Father. You guys, I, those are at least the two that came across my feed today. So really nice job. Um, hello, Ultron Unplugged. Welcome, welcome. And here's one of the just the coolest best guy i love this guy so much it's ryan aka digs figs in the house what's going on ryan um ooh, got the not wick at 5k yeah like that's you know at some point tonight we can always check out 5k and just kind of peruse i i have i have to stay away i literally have been telling myself to like not to visit that site because um this stuff is awesome <laughs> this stuff is really awesome on there uh oh grumpy nerd what's going on no we just started man i'm still just like, saying hi to the chat doing the old avengers roll call but um yeah no you didn't miss anything thanks for joining this evening happy sunday night and let's see did you see the the pigman bebop i did not oh boy was that on the uh instagram or because you know i know they they usually do like the upcoming stuff or like they, they do a really good job of dropping posts on Instagram for eventual things that will. And it's not like you have to wait and wait and wait. So um, if it's on there, then we'll have to maybe check that out later. Man Beast Boys in the house. Happy. Uh, what's going on, man? April baby here. There you go. Uh, April baby. Yeah, we are coming in. That's right. This is the official last day, March 31st. All right. All right. Here's fellow toy daddy. No chewing. What's going on? Chew. We missed you last night, man. Um, but again, you have the link for this evening. Sorry, I just wanted to clear my throat for a second. But um, yeah, of course, I sent the link to uh, the Sentinel Boys, my toy daddies, and we might get a guest appearance tonight from Cody, a.k.a. Too Much New Toys. So we'll see. We'll see. The cool thing is, and you guys know, like, once I get going talking about toys, um, I can't stop. That's <laughs> I posted like an Ace Ventura, like, cap cut template thing um, of him, like, doing the big, like, <sighs> And it's true. Once I get going, I just, I have such a hard time. I even told the guys last night, I'm like, all right, 30 minute recap show. We will just do 30 minutes and then I'll be out. And then I stayed the whole time because I love my friends and we had such a blast. So, uh, yeah, tonight, what I'm saying is I don't have to get up for, I mean, I do have to get up with my kids. Like they're still like our natural alarm clock, no matter what, but, um, yeah, I'm off. So I'm super excited. And that means tonight will go as long as my bladder allows. How about that? <laughs> uh, there's Henrock. What's going on, dude? Again, great hanging out with you last night. Woo, Captain McKay's in the house. Oh, no. Ugh. See, I knew this was part of like when I have these holiday stream episodes. Not that it's like thematic. I mean, look, I'm wearing... I wore it for J-Shot. If you guys, again, have been hanging out for a long time this past summer, it was uh, my down the shore on location um, stream where I went over the Spiro toys, the second wave that came in, and I was rocking this shirt and J-Shot loved it so much. So I wanted him to see it in all its HD glory. <laughs> but anyway, um, we got home from my parents uh you know immediately went into like bath and bedtime routine and yeah so my my i didn't dig it out i didn't dig out my reptile figure for a comparison but i know i have in a bucket here the storm collectibles evil ryu so that is going to come up so i might be able to like you know do a little tub magic and pull that guy out so we can talk about and compare it to the Jean-Claude Van Damme, the muscle from Brussels from Diamond Select. So, oh, I'm so excited about that. Um, 
let's see moving on moving on oh yeah good uh, dude always man you again i'd so i love getting to bounce ideas off of you and and all of the good things so that's great omega weapon 13's in the house what's going on buddy and oh from facebook that's right i do uh cross stream this to my facebook page obviously you know like youtube is going to be the main chat but hi there what's up me i'm maria um yes we sent diogo we shall go dude it's going to be such a blast again i we could go back to that coverage um we might that might actually that'll be one of our like road to comic con episodes we'll have to go back to all of the cool instagram posts that we, that are still up and i'm sure if i visit uh mayor tim toy chase and his page he has everything well documented but man just seeing all the friendship and fun and getting to visit you know like obviously i love my east coast boys but it'll be really great to like mix and match and get to see everybody um not just from the west coast but all over all over the place um here we go i'm waiting on the payment request for 5k oh so just so you know this is again right before the stream um i you know i was just checking the, the feed real quick and 5k posted that the emails get rolled out slowly but if you want like it says on the instagram that you can visit the links there or something and it'll take you to that second payment option so it is there buddy um let's see can't stay long oh doing easter things hey totally understand again man just like thank you for you know hanging out at all tonight as as you know um your attendance is <laughs> appreciated and never expected i love i love getting to hang out so again thank you for just hanging out as long as you're able to buddy so appreciate it here we go captain uh yeah just search second payment there you go yep all right all right um i'd love to see van dam with evil ray if he's easy to get to yes it's the tu I have tubs are here. I and I actually did a lot of basement organizing, and this is gonna go, you know, into like the life part of what I talk about in terms of being the toy photographer. I mean, one of one of the toy photographer toy reviewers, where that's really how I try to look at our action figures. And um, one of the things as a toy photographer that sometimes uh, I get blocked, but not even creatively blocked. It's more this this time. It wasn't a creative block. It was just situational like i couldn't get to things and it you know like i just kind of let myself get overrun in the basement again but um i did work hard the last few days so it is straightened up cleaned up and yes i have these tubs like right under this table behind me so woo. uh super jealous of that jcvd oh the figure the chairs oh i'm gonna we're gonna be taking a look at everything um including <laughs> including the pegs which again, I'm not knocking the figure. I, I, oh, guys, like if you are into this Jean Clavet, if you were looking forward to a figure of him, it, it really does deliver. Like I am super incredibly impressed by it. But yes, there is one little glaring thing that we need to address. But again, I'm going to show you a quick fix. Um, I'll be able to do it live with you guys. So it'll be awesome. KJ Smith, what's going on, buddy? How you doing? Yeah, East Coast in the house. That's right. Let's see. What's this I hear? Yumbo at Comic Con? Oh, yes, Marco. That's right. I, again, consensual. But if you want a big old Yumbo hug, this is going to be our time, man. I'm so excited. So, um, yeah, if you haven't heard, so the Toy Daddies, we got a ticket for Thursday. We're going to be flying out Wednesday and then staying through Sunday. So, you know, like our plan is obviously to hit the con Thursday and then just chill in the area, hang out with people. You know, if we can find a way back in, maybe um, visit again. But again, just just I hear such wonderful things about just the surrounding area and just how things spill out in terms of Comic-Con where and unfortunately, and I, I mentioned it before, but yeah, New York is just it's New York for all that mean, you know, subway boogers and <laughs> horrible smells. <laughs> again, I love New York. This is, you know, that's that's my city. That's right here. Um but yeah, it is just straight up New York when you walk from Penn to the Javits station. Um, and it doesn't feel like Comic-Con until you, you're like a block away and you start asking people in cosplay, like, what gate are you going into? How do I enter this building again? <laughs> Josh Brown, what's going on, man? Josh Brown's in the house. Again, guys, um, it's just shouting out Josh's pages. Not only does um, he have a great toy page, but then, you know, his toy store and his custom work. So Josh is killing it, man. So how you doing, Josh? Uh, let's see. I need, uh, let's see. Who is that? Chong? Chong? Oh, Chung Lee. Cause, uh, the longest time my friends say I look like, Ma oh, Master Polo. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, Glutastic with everybody in the midst of a massive reorganization of my figs. Yeah, we, we all go through this again as toy guys, you know, like doesn't mean you have to stream or not just as a toy photographer, toy collector, you know, like you have to go through those. I actually, oh no, in case he's not here or maybe he is listening and he's going to pop in and I hope he doesn't give me a, a you know, a, a stern look, but, um, I swapped out one of my displays. So I took down current, cause again, shelf space display space is at uh all time premium like if you think real estate rates no i don't want to make that joke but um no like shelf space for my my toys is lit literally at a high premium because there's not as much of it down here and i literally have all of my like turtle guys up like i just love looking at them the two all, all of the different lines so i have the turtle stuff i got legends out some neck of things but then like i dedicated a whole Tr like shelf space to my mythic and cosmic and as beautiful as they're to look at and i am happy i have them and i'm gonna obviously keep using them to to photograph um i swapped them out for my x-men and that's like you guys know like i haven't been shooting it's been a running joke of mine like not shooting my x-men for like forever and after the show you know i'm so fired up the show is giving me life in terms of ideas and wanting to just gravitate towards using them and uh this is going to make that easier for me so and plus i want to look at them and i had that you know i guess i showed you my deep lake makes uh x-men sign so they look really great they really do <laughs> so i had to i had to make a big swap it was a big swap but like I said, they're not going anywhere. I love my I love my mythics and cosmics. Um, it's just yeah, it was just a matter of what I want to you know when I come down to the basement and just stare. That's that's what I want to look at right now is my X Men. Um, let's see. I'll see you Thursday. Make sure you bring your energy drinks. <laughs> that's fair. That's fair. I mean, you know, I'm gonna be hopefully. I joke all the time. I don't know if you guys can tell, but as like a high energy guy, um, like you know, I'm the kid that had a, a trouble falling asleep like on christmas eve and then then the closest that came to in my adult life for a long time um like i played amateur baseball like again it was a sunday baseball league it was an old man's league but um it was baseball you know like i was very proud of myself i was still pitching and i ran the team etc and um those first few years especially that first year saturday nights like i could not sleep. i was just so amped to like get on the mound to get to play so because again it was once a week so um yeah, I hope that I'll be able to sleep well and come in because, like, no matter what, I'm going to be at 11. It's just going to matter at what time I crash. <laughs> That'll be the longevity. Um, Josh Brown, I need to get a shirt that says accepting your bull hugs. Yes. Oh, my God. That <laughs> That's actually, I love that. I love that. This way I know. It's like a name tag. <laughs> that is great oh and cody's here what's going on cody yes i did that's right i got a new cut um yeah that was uh tuesday so this past week man it was um it was parent teacher conferences so what that means is um a little bit short but then it's like i go back at night so just it's it's funny like i can stream you know and and be fine the next day but obviously, like when you're going back to like your place of employment and, you know, wanting to present, obviously, I get to be a little bit more relaxed with you guys, you know. Um, but, yeah, it's just, a, you know, more more serious talking and things like that. So it was a it was a tiring week. It was a very tiring week. Um, I do apologize to my brother in law. We just we did it for one week. Um, but my brother in law, Mike, we um, were trying to get into uh, playing Call of Duty Um back into like the swing of things and like picking one night a week so we started we picked a Monday, and then we did it and then this week i was like dude I, I need to go to bed early and then like i dropped the ball on thursday so i'm we're gonna get back in the swing of things so it was like a one week all right let's do this every week and then i skipped a lot but that was on me that was on me um but yeah so tuesday tuesday uh i had an early dismissal and that was my time to like be able to go. So I went to sports clips. <laughs> and I got the trip. If anybody's ever been to sports clips, they, they it's the triple play is the second tier. It's like I I've, I've complained about. I was like, you know, this messes me up every time. But the triple play. So I got the nice face towel, and it was just. And then I let her. I was like, yeah, yep, do the beard too. Let's get it all done. So <laughs> the 
that's a long one of way of saying I hadn't had a haircut since July and thank you Cody <laughs> Turtles Nerd I ordered mine um oh from Gundammit all right um yeah Cody's up on the stream everybody loves Cody we want Cody that's right man um no I dude again this is my my mythic stuff has been up since Sir Trevor uh hooked me into them. So they've had a prominent display in here and you know, like really, like in terms of usage and my photography and like videos and stuff, I wasn't really using either of them, but now X-Men has my creative pull. So that's you know, like this they swap out. You know how this is. They, you know, like you pick and choose, you pick and choose. Um and there's there's a vote for X-Men over Legions. There you go. Uh, it's okay, stay up all night. Yeah, that's the other thing. You know, that's that's going to be late nights, I'm sure. Uh, Captain McKay just got back from 5K. The Fury, uh, oh, there you go. The Fury TMNT figures are paid up. So there you go. Excellent, excellent. <gasps> Ooh, and Diggs got his Mezco Turtles in. So. I know it's a little hard to see right now, but this is where I shoot or I've been shooting my um, Mezco reviews. So all of my Donnie figures are out back here currently. But here's the thing. Donnie was going to be up next and he's still going to get his due. I'm not I'm, I'm certainly not a guy that puts down any of the turtles. They're all equally awesome. Um, so I want to do that one. But I got my Captain America from Marvel Select. Again, thank you, Zach. Oh, and um, he's going to be next. So I pulled all of my uh, Captain America figures. So I have a Figuarts, I have a Mezco, and then like a ton of Legends. So um, that's going to be tomorrow. That's going to be my little filming session for tomorrow. So I'm excited. So that'll get he, so Donnie's getting skipped. But again, it's spring break. Like guys, I plan on cranking out videos, and I think I'm just gonna drop them when I finish them. Like I can, like I normally do anyway. I, I have a hard time like finishing up by a certain day. But here we go. I see a friend backstage. So let's bring him on now, and then of course I'm going to continue saying hi to everybody. But here we go. You know him. You love him. He's the bad boy of the toy daddies. <laughs> What's going on? Yeah, that that's me, the bad boy type. Oh yeah. Come on now. You know this. What's, What's going, going on, on guys? Oh, Happy guys. Easter, man. Hi, Happy Easter. Guys. <laughs> toy father being to the upper left. Yeah. <laughs> well, hopefully we get a, a toy father appearance tonight. I think he was thinking about it. And uh I know again, no pressure on Machu or J Shop, but Machu was tempted to um crack open his Mondo Batman figures that we I feel like our conversation a few weeks ago ended up <laughs> enabling him into buying them from Toy Mart. Well, no, he did. He bought them on Entertainment Earth, and then he ended up canceling those to get Toy Mart. <laughs> you're, you're welcome, Toy Mart. That was going to be a sweet penny I would have gotten. Yeah. Uh, yeah. He went all in on Entertainment Earth, but like, whoa. But <laughs> as I always tell people, you know, it's come up a few times. Don't use the code if you can get it cheaper somewhere else. Right. All cool. Right. <laughs> and especially at Anthony's Stable. Hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No, Mirth is always, awesome. Always. He's and, the best reseller out there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Again, he's he's because he's like, you know, he's one of us. So, yeah. you know, he gets to a point. He always wants to play with the new toys. He always wants to shoot the Super new toys. Reasonable. And then, yeah, like he's just out to, you know, keep the rotating door of toys. Might be the most mentally healthy collector that we have in our community. Yeah. Like, I, I got it. I love it. Now I'm going to send it along to the next person, but I'm not going to rake them yeah. over. It's right. Just like, hey, I I played with it. It's open. Yeah, yeah. Here's a little bit of a discount. Enjoy. Yeah. <laughs> so um, let's see. Ooh, where was I? I was I lost my place in the chat. Oh, that was a digs figs. Okay. So Cody, hopefully later. There you go. He Cody. knows that uh, this is Yimbo Unleashed tonight. So you know, like I said, it's it's a matter of my bladder. But now that I have some, uh, at the very least, too, if it's me and you tonight, pee breaks. I'll I can always take a pee break. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be at no chewing takeover <laughs> yep <laughs> and again hashtag we want cody there you go week. can you believe that it's wrestlemania weekend oh my god is it right next weekend yeah saturday sunday oh well then we should probably figure out if we're doing a, a watch along <laughs> if you guys want a watch along put that yeah in let us chat. let us know in the chat absolutely um so rg what's going on buddy how are you 
And Josh Brown said, "Ooh, his Mezco turtles arrive tomorrow. That oh, is exciting. Oh, it's so I'm exciting." A, another nice person in the community reselling mm -hmm. some of the part of his collection outwards. You know, real nice. These are you guys are gonna again. This is this is just sharing excitement. It's not meant to build FOMO. Like I mean, again, like I'm I'm just saying. I these are really I've ex I've enjoyed them a lot and. Yeah. They're beautiful. I need to go back to them. I need to get a better case for them because take them in and out of the box. God, I've cracked that box a lot. <laughs> I, have oh, to get, I have to get my um what what would the what was that uh, makeup container in the eighties? Kabuto? <laughs> was that called? <laughs> well, I don't know about that, but I will tell you. Check this out. This was so at my target. This was a rollback. It was like two thirty eight. It's the nice sterilite, like where it has the little latches, mm -hmm. and everything i bagged each turtle individually but all that stuff fits in here so now i feel like i can so all my guys are displayed and then this is now like all nice and organized for me so that's cool and it's look it's not like it's not big like i actually have one of those um from uh cox Crate. when he sent me a bunch of his mafex he put it in oh, that nice. to, mm -hmm. to you know to ship yeah yeah and of course like got it you have all your was, Chinese food containers. Exactly. Like, this is what I see. Like, all my X-Men. I have my male X-Men tray with accessory hands and heads. And then I have my females in a separate one. <laughs> it's X-Men and X-Women. That's okay. <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> Doombot 9000, hello. Thanks for joining us this evening. And, yeah, there we go. The Chewy. Hey, what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> and there you go. Rabbit Dead hey, saying hi. Good um cal said chewy are you doing a photo of the uh match everyone wanted to see jean-claude van damme versus rob van damme i didn't ask for jean-claude but now i will i think i have yeah. to. oh I have my to god that, um rvd and thanks again cal yeah but, um, yeah on the road to wrestlemania you know short road short road next week um i i think i gotta get a few shots in like that i got i got cody i need to take a photo of and i got rvd Oh, did it, where's your ring? Is it still like assembled? Oh, it is in pieces. <laughs> I want in the closet. It, it was oh, just too big. okay. No, it was huge. Yeah. Oh, I know. I know. It takes up a big chunk of space in uh, my laundry room, and that's something that like my wife and I like are going to be handling because we fortunately share the same break this week. So, um, you know, it's it's like whenever the kids are at pre K, we're going to be house stuff. So like the it's going to rain the next four days, which is annoying. So the bait the garage is still like. That's gonna work. And that's gonna have to wait till next weekend. But yeah, laundry room. But yeah, that that ring is huge. I have that NXT uh, authentic one, and it's just it's massive. We gotta do at least one shot leading up. If we do a watch along, we need mm -hmm. to do at least one. Yeah, Cal says back to back. I <laughs> one of the things that Chu and I talked about is, um, you know, again we have, we've had such a blast doing the the previous two, um, but because it's a two night affair, like maybe looking at the match listings for each night and kind of like just doing a piece of it you know like we'll just do a little bit i don't know we'll see or maybe again it could roll into this stream anyway we could kind of have it on while we do sunday night <laughs> I, I only caught the first like 10 minutes of last night's previously on x-men but yeah i love how you were supposed to be on for 30 minutes i definitely mm -hmm. tuned in at 10 15 and i was and still, still going how long did you stay for how long was it it was like just over an hour it, oh. but um but yeah, I like the guys afterwards were like, yeah, I thought 30 minutes. I even made the joke, you got me for 30 minutes of playtime. <laughs> no, and then I still was like, no, I have so much fun. You know how it is. No, you're on the Roman Reigns schedule on Saturdays. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> you make an appearance, <laughs> yeah. call some shots, you raise a finger and you're out. <laughs> yeah, no, I I, uh, I did I did a little bit more. But yes, Art, as I'm playing with my hair, yes, I, I did get my hair cut. It's something I like. Right, it. Art, I like it. Art, shouldn't, he, shouldn't he, you both spend more time on hair care? His hair I got probably should. Green. I did. No, I know. I need. I know. This is better. This is better. Next but now it's like a reset. So I'll be I'm a super now. hats thing. People, <laughs> <laughs> when it gets so far along, people just sends you send in like four or five bucks every time. Like, yeah, but you gotta get Erica. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is a visual medium. <laughs> I mean, again, going back, I, I hit up Josh, uh, First Strike Figs, because Wednesday night I had missed uh, the top 10 again for Parent Teacher Conference. Like when I got home, my wife and I, like this week, we were crushed. We crushed through all the episodes of um, The Three Body Problem on Netflix. Again, we highly recommend it. It was 
really just fascinating and interesting um but yeah so like we did that and then i just was i couldn't i was just like uh uh but i went back and i, and I was watching and when josh said the ever-evolving haircuts from our hairstyles brings him joy i had to reach out to him i was like josh you cracked me up man that was too funny <laughs> so funny he, i am determined one of these weeks he's gonna make his um he has a resolution like 10 yeah. goals for the year, one of which is to come in number one. Oh, hell so yeah. So I'm rooting for him. He's, yeah, he's been yeah. like a few times hitting the top five. I just want yeah. him to the number one slot. Same, 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 same. So good for you. Yeah, Josh, oh, keep up the great work. And that, that was, was an amazing Mando shot on the on the BMX bike. That was oh, so yeah. good. I thought that was the winner. I was like, wow. Yeah. <laughs> well, 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 speaking of calling shots, um, it's been, I actually did, uh, I never shared it, but I, saw it i have that app called time hop that like you know takes you through like your previous instagram facebook posts like throughout the years and you know on this day you posted this stuff camera roll and i think it was now two or three years ago that i won my mezco monday and i've i've eased off the brakes like i've i've submitted some some entries for it but there was a while where i was going hard and um yeah I'm going for it this so tomorrow. I'm so excited. I'm, dude, you saw that setup, man. I'm so fired. I, it's going to be a matter of like, I hope the practical version hits. I used a lot of uh, atmosphere aerosol and um, mm -hmm. I have to see if I, you know, everyone's, I don't know if I, if I do some digital stuff to it too. Um, I want people to know that atmosphere aerosol is very effective. You don't mm -hmm. need the $250 PMI smoke ninja. It's come up a couple times. I'm like, it's a fun. I'm having a blast with it. Yeah. You don't necessarily need it. You can use eight dollars and get, you, the, get similar effects. Or I'm still <laughs> looking at that Ulanzi. I haven't. I haven't checked. Ulanzi um, 120, and mm -hmm. then you get um some some promo codes. Yep. Uh, speaking of, look here. Here's Toy Mirth. What's going hey. on, Anthony? We were we were uh, sharing the love again. Uh, Anthony is one of the TPC Discord moderators and host of Figuratively Speaking on Thursdays. Here's Art G. The next show for Figuratively Speaking is on April 11th. So tune in. Okay. Very cool. Uh, WrestleMania tickets, they're still available? Oh, man. we're This is all in Philly, right? Is this Philly? Yeah. Oh, man. That's a R. couple G, hours away. Are you, going? Away. Are you and Yamoka going to live away. stream right from the stands? That would be fun, Art. That would be fun. Oh, man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> As you're I making it... my... now i'm not doing right <laughs> <laughs> well the, remember this is a chewy and i like you know with this whole road to comic con um even though i did just buy more toys today and yesterday yeah, the, the, the rage angry fury not i did that girls. i did that yesterday was the end of um a 20 off of 75. 70 75 so i what I ended get? up, I got long shot because, you know, okay. I'm going to get that mojo from okay. you. Yep. Um, and then I ended up, <laughs> God, I'm trying to think of who else I ended up ordering. Long shot. And the one that's jumping out that I'm actually like, he's whatever. He's one of my role models. Look at how we are as toy daddies, right? I had this figure in my hand so many times at Target. And then I find it was like 27 bucks. And then with the code, I got the Bob Ross NECA figure. <laughs> I'm not I, upset by that. That's a right. Idea. I mean, like, I love Bob Ross. I, I, I didn't expect you to say that. Right. Being like he's a role model. He Bob, is. I mean, no, no. Just where I thought you were going to go for role models. I'm like, did he find, like, I don't know, another CM Punk? Or I don't know. Did you find your Jack Kirby figure? No. Oh, I do want that Kirby. See, I that's do. what I mean. That's There's, my number oh. one. That's so my number else? one. I want that Jack Kirby. Who's the other one I got? Oh, you know what? This a figure that... I had originally passed on, but to get to the point where, like, it was so I got three, so it was twenty dollars a figure if I look at long shot for twenty, which again it would be technically more, whatever. But Bob Ross for twenty, and then I got the Falcon, the comic Falcon. Oh, with the wings. Yeah, because it's like what what do they call it? Right. The I'm looking at now the um, mm -mm -mm, the symbol of truth. So the comic book Falcon, you know, like you and you know, I've been leaning more into the comic book stuff, figure. so. The initial run of that figure without the wings it's okay a good figure. yeah so what could i uh so that was that that was yesterday hey yambo life is short i know i've been <laughs> heckling you from the wings to be like hey save your money save your money but life is short enjoy yourself well and then today 
today. Oh, no. You're going to tell me something else. All right. I'm trying not to judge you. You're no, player. I know. I know. I have to write all of these down. Again, my total is going to probably now creep into the 50s. It still but... says 27 on our slides. <laughs> well, that's silly. I've updated that before. But um, it uh, Spider Shot, even though I don't. So this is where I feel silly because I don't know the character. But it's that that book that I love and like an assassin. He's an assassin. Yeah. Spidey. So like, I don't know. I'm kind of interested. And in, if I do read the comics, I'm going to want the figure. And then my neighbor Dan, Captain 1134, um, totally enabled me on the Jack O' Lantern figure. Oh, I'd originally, that's a good one. You know, so I can't. So I put those two on order now, um, with, because today, just so you guys know, targets were closed. But that wave, you had to search for Spider Man. You couldn't search for under Marvel Legends. But if you search Spider Man, that that wave is up. All Hallows Eve or whatever her name is. I thought about her too, but I'm again. That was where I was like, I'm gonna be good about her. <laughs> There's my line. Yeah, and, and then literally, I pay for the Rage toys, and then I'm like, oh, and then I added Jean and Magneto to my Amazon cart, but I haven't, I haven't pulled the trigger yet. So, I almost I uh, pre-ordered, you know, those Tunchy uh, Metal Slug figures. Where yeah, when it looks like April, I almost mm -hmm. because we were, or you know, fulfilling the the five K order on those Not Turtles. I was like, might as well get Not April too. Luckily enough, <laughs> it was sold out. I'm like, all right. It wasn't meant to be. See, it was the universe telling you. There you Slow go. Down. You're again, Turtles, you probably don't need, but you'll love. You don't need another $100 coming out of your bank account. <laughs> I know. I know. Um, but speaking of buying toys, this guy last night bought maybe some of these during the X-Men stream. What's up, Toy Father? <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's Toy Day's night. What's going on? Change the background. I'm just kidding. Oh, oh, I would if I <laughs> should have that set up. <laughs> Actually, no, it's, it's stock. You could, but I'm just messing with you. <laughs> oh, or, um, but what's up, man? So what, you got the Magneto. Yeah. Was that last night? Uh, yeah. What did you order last night? One day shipping? Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. The Nightcrawler is great. Is, aren't you happy <laughs> to have that Nightcrawler? I, you know, it was a cool one. I, I got to say... First of all, hey guys. Good to see Hi. You. Hey buddy. <laughs> um I do have the original which I love and it's awesome, but this articulated tail is so cool. Is yeah. it bendy? Yeah, it's bendy. Oh. Is it bendy? I never even tried to bend. I just rotated around. Well, well, maybe it's just rotating. But it's but it's it... it's much better than the other tail. <laughs> Don't break oh, your toys, nice. people. Don't break your toys. <laughs> um have you, I wonder do the heads swap? From the original, from the because you said that there were like two or three on that. Let me see. Let me go grab it. Ooh, all right. So that's yeah. So there you go. So that was part of Chris's uh, purchases during the show last night. <laughs> I hope they fit because that would be awesome. I mean, if he can have because I like the Nightcrawler look for this this show. Like I like that figure, but it is like a younger, kind of more innocent Kurt looking guy. When do you think we'll see him? I don't know, man. I mean, based on our conversation last night, I have no idea where this show is going at any given point. Do you think I literally... we'll see him or do you think it'll be Morph? Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> Could you imagine? Well, like, how far? All right. So the, the joke last night of if you buy the Morph figure, right, with the random, <laughs> you don't know what toy you're going to get <laughs> in the box. <laughs> the, oh, the blind that box. Was... The blind box. A Morph blind box. Amazing if. if... Hasbro just went for it. <laughs> like, it could be anything. It, it could be anything. Anything left in the stock. You know, yeah. like Hasbro Pulse. Anything left. Just put a shipper box that has Ooh. a more face. I mean, like. <laughs> oh, here. Hold here. You want to hold that bad boy? Oh. So there's it, the. This head sculpt is awesome. It yeah. works. It looks like a younger night Nightcrawler. That's uh, neat. I do have to say. I like though, it. Yeah. The tail's pretty much the same so <laughs> oh so just okay. kind of spins around it's, it's okay. i haven't played with this toy in a while <laughs> but pinless pinless joints and uh just really he's smooth he's very smooth 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 but yeah uh, um x-men 97 jeez i just wanted these toys so badly i know that the magnet that's why magneto and gene that i told you that the, the one gene that i have the vhs one was so frustrating and it seems that she's universally praised. Um, face sculpt for both jeans, like the love triangle one and yeah. VHS. But they they improved it. So Yeah, no, that's what I mean. 97. Plus, she actually has double jointed elbows, so she can do like the... Okay. Yeah. 
Um, Omega 13, Omega Weapon 13. Ooh, well, here we go, Chris. Let's throw that up real quick. What do you guys think? Uh, brighter reds, deeper black. Yeah. I don't know. It kind of looks the same. <laughs> With the exception <laughs> of the head sculpt. I like the new head sculpt. This one? Yeah. I like, I like the hair. Wow. Yeah, I like. I like again. I I think that's really great that you now have all of those head sculpts from the first one to use on the new buck. Yeah, that's true. So I support this it. Is, I support it. I would say this is like uh, during COVID Nightcrawler, and this is like before. What? Where he's sad? <laughs> what do you mean? No, his um his hair. Oh, because it's so long he couldn't get to a barber. Fair. Oh. <laughs> There you go, Yimbo. It's Yimbo Crawler. Yeah. Yes, I like it. We're, hey, uh, Twin Father had it growing out too back then too. He was <laughs> he was rocking the bandanas and headbands with no, me. Yeah. <laughs> Twin Father <laughs> just hides. Yeah, but this this is new from COVID because I never had. It was all short. Every I tried for to most of my one life. Time and I just could not. I got to a ponytail like a small one. I'm just like. I hate it. I gotta get this off my head. <laughs> you gotta outgrow the awkward stage. Just to and that's it. that's what I had just entered, guys. Like it was it was make or break because it was not only messing with my forehead, the the swooshing, but then it was on the back of my neck, and I'm like, oh god, this is this is a thing. This is the, uh, it's it's go big or go home, and I went home. <laughs> that rugged, that weird hair coming off the back. <laughs> yeah, for, it was for some for some reason, like you two were laser focused talking. Uh, like talking about toys when it's just, when it's the three of us though i don't have i have no idea where this conversation goes like anywhere it could go anywhere this is the life part of the podcast and I, that's <laughs> you know, I was thinking about like, hair care, care and like keeps.com i'm like when keeps. when should i start worrying about hair loss hmm. oh i mean <laughs> i didn't know where I, you're going with that. no joke i asked my barber that i'm like hey yeah I was thinking, do i start I have to start worrying about hair loss he said no so I'm like, all right, okay, you're good. And then remember, it's it's uh, look to your grandfather on your mom's side genetically, so that helps. My my son is screwed, but um, because both his grandfathers uh have been a mother on the father's side. Grand no grandfather on your mother's side. Yeah. So oh. my grandfather had a big old like Elvis pompadour that he would. <laughs> so that was always the joke growing yeah, up. Check out some hair loss websites, Len, because I'm pretty sure he was bald. <laughs> <laughs> Not sure if it was by choice. <laughs> uh, Omega Weapon 13 yeah. says, um, yes, a fishing tackle box for your accessories. That works great. Also, I have um, for my other, like what I pulled out for all my X-Men stuff, but that was from a bead accessory kit at Walmart. Like it's a, oh. it's basically another tackle box tray, but it's great for a bigger, the larger accessories. And I've had all the stuff in there, but yeah, I good. want little compartments to put like the pieces separately than having them all touch. <laughs> when did Cody? Who was talking about taking pictures of Cody? <laughs> I take pictures I of you, buddy. I must have glossed over this one. <laughs> I take pictures on TikTok. He's showing off his knees. Very sad. Uh, <laughs> uh, Toy Mirth, um, yeah, uses aeros aerosol in pretty much all of his shots. He took a great Easter shot today. He's got that awesome factory. I think he won a Mezco Monday or a fan feature with. No, it was a Mezco Monday. Um, remember when he had the mezits coming down and Vapor was painting all of them? Oh yeah. yeah. So he's got that fantastic s setup, and today was um, a concept of painting the uh, Easter eggs, like helping the Easter bunny out, getting them all ready. It was really awesome. Nice. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, Art says, "I wish I could go out to work and use up all my PTO for a vacation in June." Okay, but if I were going, I'll call out. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, let's see. Spider-Man Retro Way was worth hunting during the 20 off 75 sale at Target. Yeah, again, I never saw any of those in person. The only thing that were like my pegs have been dry, and I, I know I'm not the NECA, only one. NECA is actually qualifying for that. Yeah, those sales off too. They That's Bob Ross, them. baby. Oh, I should have got that Channel Six one then. Yeah. Oh, was it at the store? Yeah, it's been there for like three years oh man yeah i think they they must have budged on that because you know how like their stuff typically doesn't go on any kind of like sale and, but and typically those shelves are full yeah right yeah. so um that would have been good but yeah my pegs have been dry they had like mary jane not mary jane mj um from no way home for like nine bucks and like that's all that was left it was like oh. a few of those yeah um but there's no cow the toy father has arrived 
Let's see. Yes, the parts of old Nightcrawler and, all, and new will all work well together. Here we go. Captain McKay says, looking forward to that Nightcrawler. I'm glad the heads from the older one work perfectly. I just got Cyclops. And yeah, the Cyclops is great. I'm glad you like it too, man. That's such a good one. Uh, Dick says, I have a feeling the blind boxes would be all it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. That would be great. <laughs> Why? Isn't that so um, funny? I need That's... justice for Selma Hayek. <laughs> The She's the one that I don't have her movie and she gets stuck in that. <laughs> oh man. I didn't like, but I do have that wave because I wanted Gilgamesh. Like he was the only reason I ended up buying them at a discount, like Why a deep discount like whenever I could find pieces. What's up? What possessed you to want to build that build a figure before watching the movie? No, I did it after watching the movie. Oh, okay. These, that's the thing. These fig, I'm like, it's so funny that the Eternals is such, I mean, what a, it's a bummer. I wish the movie had been better. I wish it hit. But it is very comical now that that's like, that's well, the line. That... <laughs> that was the moment in time when the MCU started to slip. Yeah, right. That one moment, you're like, oh, man. <laughs> it had, it had, I felt like it still had a chance. There's still, there's still highlights of that movie, but it's not one that I feel compelled to go back. I gave it, I gave it a second viewing once, but. There's a lot of that could funny. happen in that first act. But Diggs, hold on. The, the quick point is Morph has to change into that character during the show. <laughs> so I don't think we're going to get any Eternals references during X Men 97. I'm just Could you saying. imagine? That's, that's how they move the figures. <laughs> that, would be, that would be hilarious. That would be incredible. <laughs> oh, literary action figs in the house. What's going on, man? How hey, are you? On? Oh, man. So, um,. Where do we where do we want to start? Do we want to keep the uh, the X Men the hair hair care? What do you want? Where do you want to go into, guys? Because I know you have some diamond stuff too that we can talk about. Uh, you you leave the show, Yumbo. I mean, I feel like we yeah. should ride the X Men wave because you've been really admiring X Men all weekend. It's yeah, true. Yumbo reviews everything. Oh yeah. no! I know. All right, all right, all right, all right. Your jaw is underneath my face. <laughs> <laughs> fair, fair. Um, all right. Well, here a couple little toy photography tips. We'll start. We'll start with toy photography because that's what we are. That's what we do. So a uh, couple things. I forget if I ever got to talk about these, but this one. <laughs> so oh, this that. is from the Five Below. Like I think there were Chloe and Zoe, and there's a couple. Of, anyway. I talked about them with the high school lockers where I bought them for the locker set. I bought two of them and gave them to my daughter. Well, now they have this influencer. <laughs> it's literally like called the Zoe or Chloe like influencer kit. So I gave my daughter the doll and it had like a little makeup tray and um, makeup kit and just all whatever. It was all makeup. But so for $5, I bought it for this because I wanted the ring light. And what's cool is the phone i mean obviously like i don't want this sticker on it but the the phone piece does come out so that's just a little sticker clips on so i could put one of my other toy phones you know blue tack on there so for super action stuff for instance but yeah so what do you think a five dollar accessory of a little tripod ring light I'm that was like, worth it right yeah right yeah <laughs> when you when you showed that to us i was i was immediately looking for it i yeah i want i want that badly so yeah five bucks five bucks and then um i forget if i got to talk to you guys about this before i've had this now for at least a couple of, but like i haven't used them yet they're just awesome these are from um the bandai the instamashi shf like rocks so um Those the link big. wow these are this is heavy and like these all port together so that's how these work. And I, it, it is like a little puzzle to get them like lined up the way you want. But I made two of these, but they can also then stack up higher. Um, but I bought the fire effects and this set of rocks. And you can see like, with Lone Wolf Labs, you know, work behind me. That looks great, right? Like they, these look awesome. You have so, to bust out the, um, you have to use Gene and then break up all those pieces and have that like, last jedi ray moment type photo yeah like well look at here I'll, I'll, I'll just pull this one apart so you guys can see man those are cool right and so I you love get... that dio too yeah this is this is all part this was part of my bat cave i actually oh. email or not me emailed i said i was talking to um to kevin lone wolf labs who, who i love so much um I, I hit him up 
to tell him like, hey man, I'm like, I was like, I, I, I had to break down the bat cave. I said, but in doing so, I was looking at it in a different light and I realized, you know, I used it for that X-Men shot that I took for our upcoming collab too. And um, I realized like I can use this into like a Mr. Sinister science lab, especially after watching that episode, episode three. So again, no spoiler, sorry. Oh, that's the... <laughs> This is not the spoiler episode, but um, yeah, like a Mr. Sinister lab. And so, so this is part, this is the flooring of the Batcave that um, he actually, it's magnetized and everything. But yeah, so, oh, and I'm, he's going to, it, tur it turns out that um, I'm going to be getting another dial from him oh, <laughs> in nice. that conversation. So is not a secret. In no, it's um. Later? No, you know what? Here, let me take this down. Let me go. I'll, I'll bring it up on his. Oops, sorry, Chris. There we go. I'm gonna pull it up on his um, Instagram because it's up there. It was the prototype city. I didn't realize it was a prototype. I know he was gonna be making making it because it was really awesome. But um, it's another. It's an <clears throat> another building for my city. It's just another. I love his building stuff. So let me just pull that up real quick. And the person who owns the current only version of this is Tenio Toy, Machu's sister. Oh, no, so really? She bought it. Yeah, yeah. That was at the um, December Toy Con. So where is it? Where is it? Ah, okay. So do you guys remember seeing this? It, it was based on the Across the Spider-Verse. There it is. Remember that the Across the Spider Verse oh, yeah, yeah. buckets of popcorn that came out, oh, man, and if you can, if you build the three together, like yeah, like um, Miles, Miguel, and Gwen were like statically holding, you know, like it was part of the holder. So he built that based off of that, and I was like, hey, are you, you know, like I sent him a bunch of stuff about the Batcave and Sinister, and then I sent him this because I was talking to Dan about it, and he's like, oh, I'm actually building one right now. He's like. I usually build two at a time, so you want that one? I was like, yes, please. <laughs> awesome. Oh my gosh. So, sold. <laughs> that one looks great. So, yeah. Right? Like I'm so I'm I, so pumped I for want, this. Look at does this. Does he make them in threes? Maybe he made this one in three. Well, he I, I'm giving him a little like I like the color. I really do like the color scheme, but then he mentioned he's like He's like, are you cool with it? He's like, I know it's a little different. So I was like, dude, I'm like, I would have never even thought in a million years. Like, I just love your stuff and I buy it. I'm like, since you're asking, I, I'm like, I Googled New York City and I sent him, like, he, I'm, I'm basically giving him artistic license to, like, use this color scheme, but maybe add some, like, just he can go wild with it. I want him to go nuts with it. So it'll be, I'm hopefully, like, yeah, I'm just pumped. I'm pumped. So, you know, his work is great. Cool. And I tell people That's all the time, amazing. like, He's a perfect guy. Like if you if you're somebody that wants to get into the Dio photographing game, <clears throat> like go with go with his stuff. Like start with him. I mean, he's fantastic. You guys know. Like you have you have his work too. So yeah, he's awesome. He's such a nice guy. Um, he works really hard and he puts it all into his Dios, and they it shows up. And and they're yeah. so they're they're very versatile in terms of what you can do with them. So and there's there's still they're very affordable yeah so i don't know for... a bunch of different things because we dabble across so many different toy lines you could get something that looks like new york city right. but you could get something that looks like you know mythic legion and it yeah. won't hurt <laughs> you know yeah. like, you a yeah. bunch of different things that's right i mean and again i i, I do look forward to eventually getting back into having the back cave in its all its glory because that's how i've been using it like outside of like i've used it for photos um but really that's just been a thing like a piece that i love looking at but now i'm trying to you know use these parts as other dio enhancements see what other kind of like settings i can i can make out of it um but yeah i do look forward to eventually getting back back to it being a back cave because i just love all this stuff um but here we go let's see looking at some things here oh agent baron i love those rocks and again guys quick uh you know it's on my amazon storefront again any any of that stuff doesn't cost you any extra money but it would help fund what we do here on the channel so it's just as an fyi uh let's see i want to grab some of the superhero landing yeah the cracked ground accessories i have um i have the one that was actually the color of this rock but because all my stuff is typically like 
street based New York City, like city scenes, I ended up painting it gray. But they make a gray one, so I was just being redundant. But um yeah, that they're great too. They're they're a lot of fun and they split apart too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's as far as I can go. <laughs> but those are great and they also come apart, so like I've used that for like Hulk smashing through a wall and just pieces everywhere. And uh hey Dwight Studios, what's going on, man? Oh uh off to to my interview. Oh, where are you going? Who's wait, where's he on tonight? We're gonna have to go track it down. To our if it's nine o'clock. I don't know. <laughs> okay, well we'll have to look. So uh, I, I I wasn't aware, of it, but Brian, oh man. Um shout out to Duart for um the Henrock Mezco or it, it's a Mezco it's the Playmates customized party van that he turned into like a Mezco wagon. Did you guys see that? Yeah, that's beautiful. Yeah. That's yeah, it looks so, so good. <laughs> yep, yep. So shout out, shout out there. Um, but yeah, so those rocks are great. I just wanted to let you guys know um, that they that they exist and have on some Amazon, them. they're on Amazon for thirty dollars, and you can get them overnight shipping. They can show up at your door seven to eleven a.m. That's not bad, guys. Just saying. Chris has already ordered two. In I the hope time, you my, I bad. hope you lose my link. <laughs> Use Jimbo's link, all caps. <laughs> all right, so there's my toy. Type in Jimbo's on for 5%. <laughs> <laughs> all right, before we get into so Chris, that's do you cool. have your Jean-Claude near you? No, no, no. Um, That's in a separate shipment. Because this oh, one, isn't... this this shipment sent off before he could add to it. And he's like, don't worry, I got, I got one coming. Okay. All right, so before we get to him. Oh, there's the Machu. Hey, the Machu toy. All right, so we'll see. We'll see about you hopping on tonight, buddy boy. The Mondo. I want to see um, your JCVD and all of his glory. Oh, we're going to. Last night. Oh, we will. And here's our boy Autumn Knight, King Eternal, over here. What's going on, Eric? Buddy. (laughs) Speaking of turtles, Turtle Boy. Oh, Machu's not home yet. Okay. All right. Well, don't worry. Again, we've been saying this. This is, there's no time. There's no time limit. So you guys, I'll, we'll go as long as we want to go, or you guys can always dip Kimbo's whenever you want to dip. All night. So he's going to go the next 24 hours of streaming. That's awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> that would, hey, you guys are here. We'll, we'll, we'll keep rolling. Um, so now my question for the chat and for you guys, and I, I originally posed it to when I found it. I bought these. Which was this, these are the what is it the comic book series? So these are the new ones inspired by the eighty four art. So all four brothers were there. Donnie was actually the, like the only one. There was a few couple duplicates. I got tricked up into thinking that these were the original sketch versions, which is so silly because when I saw the pictures again, I'm like, oh, these are these look nothing like that. So, what do you guys think? Should I bother keeping them? Like they're neat, but do I need? Do I need to hang on to them? I feel like they'd be fun, but also like I know what these Playmates toys are also like. So, I don't know. Uh, <clears throat> Lay it I on mean, me, Chew. Do you, Do you like them? I like the look of them. Like that was, that was a pregnant pause, Yimbo. No. Yeah, I them. should get. I should return them. That, that it was. That pause was eight months pregnant. <laughs> you cannot keep from that. <laughs> Only, yeah. You know what? Because I, I have my... Um, here we go. These are fun for 10 bucks, right? Like $10 Playmates Turtles are neat to have. I know Cody loves them. I love them too. I have the Rise of the Ninja Turtles. I have these guys. Obviously, the OG ones are neat. Is that customized? This is customized, yeah, with my Gundam marker, which we're going to get to when we talk to... Um, why Jean Claude Van Damme's action figure is so alpha. <laughs> we'll talk about that. But yes, I use my Gundam marker to customize this guy. He's double he's double the alpha. We'll, we'll get there. But um Yeah, I you know, what do you guys think? Like like these are these yeah, are cute you- to have. I like having them, but like, you know, I don't play with them that often. I you know, I try to give them to my kids and even they were they're just not into the turtles like I am. Like I they're mean, cool. the ones that are coming out this summer are something that I will definitely buy from again the kids will like it. it's an entire mix and match 
Taro line. So all the arms and legs and heads pop off and you swap them together. Wait, which one is which one is that? The That's, the original uh, Mute, sketch one? No, no, the Mutant Mayhem TV oh. show ones. Okay. Well, let's take a look. If, if I bring this hey, up. Hey, Lone Wolf is in yeah. here. Happy Easter, hey, man. Up, Yes. I love the Beetlejuice. <laughs> Kevin, right. we were just talking about your stuff, man. Yeah, um, just, just back to those turtles that you should absolutely return. If Target was not closed because of Easter today, I would have you leave the stream to return them because well, <laughs> you don't need them. Okay. That's a stronger opinion. <laughs> that is no, but you know what? That's what I need to hear. I need to hear it because I was my, my follow up question was if you guys were like, well, they're kind of neat, whatever. Um, then would they count towards my one hundred? And if you guys were like, yeah, then Unless I would say for your kids, yeah, yeah. Where's where is I, this? I mean, like if you your daughter tell... says absolutely no, then you're out. She she gets that verdict. <laughs> But as as Chewie was saying, like you could tell in your voice that you're not you you needed some convincing to 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 uh, just keep them. So in fact, the the that you confuse them for the original sketch. I think last <laughs> week because you're on vacation this week, I think you were just tired, man. Yeah, yeah. I was. I was. I was wiped. I was buying milk. I, the reason I was at Walmart was because my, my wife texted me. She's like, can you just stop and get milk on the way home? You know, and, and I was just so tired. And I'm like, hey, you, I'm like, I don't know if I'm going to make it. I'm trying to like send the questions for the top 10 literally in the Target parking lot, like minutes before the hey, show started. The chat, he didn't come home with milk. He came home with four turtles. No, I did. <laughs> no, I did no, no. Did don't lie them. to the people. They want <laughs> authenticity. And both. He didn't come back with milk. <laughs> I did get the I did get the milk. That would have been that would shoot that would have been bad. Um, let's see. Every purchase counts towards the one hundred. That's that's fair. I that's something that like I've been counting. Like I counted the Fortnite boat, the motorboat that I bought for twenty two bucks. I'm like that counts. Like Does it's it a toy. Transform into a robot. Why is that counting? Just because it's a toy vehicle for one one six scale. Right. It's for or one twelve right. scale. Like it's for me. I don't know. Like I'm again. That's one that like if I needed to cross it off, I'm at ninety nine. Then maybe when my DeLorean comes in later this year, I'm not counting it. <laughs> yeah okay all right well then good then then then, then that's fair um oh, chris is counting his cat lair maybe we need a, a i'm counting everything. I'm is counting everything is it everything people in the chat i mean you you do you, do you count i'm counting i'm counting everything well guys this is the set that i i don't know how i mis mistook them mis right mistook them i don't know i don't know how i confuse these two um but I, those <laughs> I mean, playmates I, one I, no, I understand why you mix it up. It's the box art, and they're all yeah. they all have red minute. Like I understand why you mix it up. That's that's totally understandable. Like, I just don't. I don't think you like them. Yeah, like that's this is the ones Machu. So again, I mean, hey, if you if anybody like if these are going to be hard to get come Macho, across because it's Macho, Walmart, Machu drive safe, will you? <laughs> why are you chatting <laughs> us while driving? But Maybe you can see why I picked here. these up, right? Like these are really neat. Like this is look at the whole box art. Think, like it's it's very the box cool. Art is cool. The box art That's is cool. cool. Um, but I'm I'm also not like a do. you can yeah. get deep like to make you that logo at the top as a sign, and you'll have more value out of that twenty dollar purchase. Let's see the Lego. Uh, oh yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah actually, yeah. oh my god. Go Maybe talk to D Black A Maka. Yeah. I am to make you the sign. What about yeah? What oh I'll man. Get one too. He, what signs? if we do a, a toy daddy's a toy daddy's logo in that in that font and then like a no chewing is that what you're talking about like getting oh, our i'll do that too I, oh you just Bye. you were talking about ninja turtles i thought use this font on our names i was literally yeah. talking about ninja turtles but i'll do i'll go design <laughs> toy daddy's one right like, you remember use everything in that font style oh i, I, I don't like know. it That's i like cool. it um oh now yeah. there's nothing over here Let's oh my you saying ask jay shot if he wants one of those too so there's four yeah yeah, yeah. no i will I, I found five Machu, you want one too isn't it all by <laughs> yeah it's five just get five yeah, it's five it's five there we go um and yes, I did. then double it then double it so ten <laughs> well no he does he does double up a custom to sell elsewhere so fair so there we go. ten of them uh tj williams in the house what's going on man thanks for hey, popping in tonight and uh lone wolf same deal happy easter man i hope you had an awesome weekend buddy and again just he had a nice like you know it was it was great to catch up with him um he was in a nice little r r after toy con so um but appreciate you kev as uh, as always dude um and even turtle boy eric says i return him use those funds for hall of fun that's fair that is yeah. fair I almost was on. Shout out to local Lou. Um, like I, I almost popped in on his show uh, yesterday morning, but 
I caught like, his show for the first time. Yeah. You told me about it. I didn't know he had a show. Yeah. Raw's on uh, yesterday morning, and it was really nice. I enjoyed yeah. it. Yeah. They so were hopefully, the shop. I told him, I said, just give me, I just need a little bit more runway to, to, to <laughs> schedule it because my wife was like, I need to go out. And I'm like, you know, trying to stream with a four year old, two four year olds running around. It's not ideal. So. Oh, look at Machu saying, nope, I don't uh, want him. He's too good yeah. for it. Wow. <laughs> Well, I think he means the figures, but you were yeah, talking about the yeah. sign. All no, by no, him. I was talking about the sign. He's talking about the sign. Is he really? Uh, are you sure? I think so. He's talking about the sign. I don't know. Uh, uh, wow. Sorry, well. get, five, get five anyway. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do a giveaway. <laughs> All right. So, oh, you know what? While, while, I, uh, while we have this going. So, again, thanks to, uh, to Zach Oat for hooking us up with um you know a couple of these toys to talk about tonight because chris we ended up doing a little thank you because again we you know we like to to pay back and help you know like just thank people for being awesome um and zach is as we know a toy collector and you hooked him up with the figura obscura uh monkey king yes uh which is awesome what? No? Uh, just, no, yeah, yeah, it was awesome. I was just reading Machu's comments, sorry. Oh, no, okay. All right. Because I, I, I wasn't looking at your say. I was trying to set up my, my tab so I can show off some of Zach's toy photography. Again, yeah. Zach O, awesome toy photographer, too. So there you go. So this was the oh, thank you for just being so awesome. awesome. And then there, yeah, so he's enjoying that. And then um, I couldn't believe it, dude. I Like, it just luck by luck. Remember, we were talking about Motu, and like it wasn't one of his like childhood yes. things, but he's grown yes. to appreciate it. So I sent him that, and it turns out he told me he's like Stratos would be his like that's his favorite Motu character, and it was just by chance. That's so, crazy, that's right? Awesome. And he, look at the, oh man, I didn't even get to like this one yet, but he's he's very impressed with the wings, which I am too with Mythic. They they obviously do a great job with them. Um, but yeah, so Zach, oh man, that was so you know very cool to see you enjoying them, buddy. And now we get to talk for this about this first diamond. And then Chris, you have cap because I haven't opened my cap yet. Oh, you haven't yeah. opened cap? No, because that's going to be my like review that I'm going to film tomorrow. Like as, as soon as uh, kids go to pre-K, we get home. Like comparison video. So you had it open. You already posted a little quick review to Threads. Again, check out a th Threads is fun. Threads like is you know, fun. yeah, yeah. People like my stuff. I don't know. Yeah. Um uh I did I am doing some uh quick reels of those quick assessments that I'm doing too. So good, nice. good. That will be going out. But yeah, look at Steve. Oh boy. Yeah. Steve yeah, Rogers. Let's take this. There we go. Show them I off. like the paint on that shield. Oh my yeah, gosh. it's clean. Everything wow. about this figure is incredible. Which shield, Chewy? Because oh, it comes one. with two. The first one. Oh. <laughs> I still, yeah, I love that. I do like, I love that it's included, but for me, the circular is always going to be my favorite cap shield, but I have like, an, I have an uh, affinity for the original too. Also, you can, so you can take this off. Boop, Ooh. Pop it off. And then Ooh. Right on the back. Oh. Nice. Is this the nicest Captain America shield ever? Yeah, it's, it's awesome. Because like that, the figure that, arts one drives me nuts. The Mezco yeah. one is magnetic, which is neat, but like also a pain. It's so uh, that's sturdy. The uh, legends are like, oh boy. The harness comes off, so does this belt, so you don't need. Oh to really? Do yeah. Oh, nice. So these two come right off. Like now, question: Did you have to go heat on him? Uh, I didn't, but I probably should. Let's see. Okay. And then this can come off. Oh, nice. I like him um, with the uh, utility belt. Yeah, I do too. Yeah. And then look at these cool head sculpts. Oh, oh it comes cool. with two more? <laughs> oh, nice. Yeah. Super dope. So, yeah, the unmasked, yeah, and then the original and the update. Um, Tell me, when you get to it, they have, like, two, like, skin neck pegs. Two of them? Yeah, two of them, because they were on the head sculpts. Tell me how you get this one off. Heat. Hashtag yeah, team heat, baby. Training, that's. 
um, Machu was referring, so he was saying to send those that no one wants those figures. So, <laughs> you know, at least he doesn't want them. But the sign, we were just saying five signs back, back to five. We're back we're, to five. We're no longer mad, Machu. There you go. Machu, we were saying the sign. We we're, uh, we're going to have to hit up D Blake to use that Eastman and Laird, you know, like the Mezco logo, the Mirage, like that font, that turtle font. To not only make a turtle sign, but then maybe like I my my a little addition was what if our handles were signs in that font? I feel like that'd be pretty cool. Mm. I think that's a great idea too. Right? I'm just saying that's, that's a great idea too. Mm. Yeah. Um, get on it. <laughs> this is not TPC. That's not Wednesday. What's going on, TMTJ? How you doing, that's brother? Not my beautiful wife. That's not my house. <laughs> <laughs> Short hair and bony. That's that's right. Um, and kick it to the red, white, and blue show. I get, dude, that the fact that the thing pops out that is so nice. Ooh, I know, so that cool. Very right? cool. Uh, I, for, for a while, because there are directions, I've, I'm like staring at this thing. I'm like, how does it fit behind there? I can see the picture. How does it fit? Yeah. And I'm like, wait a minute. You, you should have seen me to like just do it. I was like, yeah, dude, it's it's just like I mean, like, isn't it funny? Like, um, with Diamond stuff or Marvel Select stuff, the Silver Centurion did that to me. Johnny Storm did that to me. Where it's like, oh, what are these pieces? And then it's like, because there's no directions. And then it's just, yeah, literally, you just keep picking at things, and eventually, oh, this moves. Oh, this popped out. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> really cool. Oh, Machu's already told him to do that version. All right, of course he beat us to it, but you know, you tell us, but whatever. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> whatever <laughs> all right let's see let's see here we go jean-claude let's see the jean-claude time oh those so, are the jean-claude chairs so these are the chairs number one that's amazing right the chairs are sick amazing as it is because obviously they have the the gaps for you know his feet to do the split but like they're just really nice chair oh i guess it does have a little bit but you know, you can you can cover that up. This is Donnie's not the best. There we go. Yeah, just blend it on. You know, Photoshop. Hey, um, with the fear ray turtles with that low indent, that'd be perfect because it has the tail. That's right. That's right. Or if I want to use the mirage, <laughs> that mirage set, right? There we go. The, the fear uh, turtles will look like little kids on those. They really, I know. So <laughs> oh, he comes. You, know you gotta do. You gotta do a series of split chair. But like Deadpool, um, Spider Man. Oh, great idea. That is a great, great idea. idea. That is a great idea. All right. I'll, I'll, all right. I'll, this, this week, this is. I have the time. I we'll have do the it time. Right now. What, turn the chair. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, Don't do he it, Tony. Well, just so you guys know, so he comes with the fists. He comes cool. with like the the grabbing hands, cool. and then he has like martial arts hands. But the grabbing hands are for. Oh, man, this I'm is so the... excited for this one. Dude, it's <laughs> so, so awesome. I'm excited for this one. A glass bottle completes, uh. completes, and then broken bottle. No. With the bottom. Stop <laughs> I... it. Yes. So it has a, sh a broken <sighs> bottle. How freaking awesome is that? I'm yeah. so... Uh... And these chairs are really cool. It gives me the goosebumps. Oh, look, I got the stupid goosebumps. I know. But you gotta slap them. Final boss. Look Come on. Look at how. So those are just that. Now this is the head sculpt that he came with out of the package. This <laughs> package. That's it's gonna. Awesome. That's gonna. That joke's gonna come back. Um, <laughs> this is the better of the two that I got. So unfortunately, oh, of course. Sorry. And just before I get into anything, Diamond always has the posing stand, which is oh, great. Nice. Yeah. Cool. Okay, so I really like the second head sculpt, and uh, <laughs> my paint job. And this is like whatever. I'm not gonna complain about it because this I, to me, like he just got pummeled and whatever. But the one eye on mine is a little wonky, but not the end of the world. Again, this is look at the other rest of the detail. I got this is smaller. Do you think they'll ever make the um? Who's the, who's the person that he faces at the end? Chong Lee. <laughs> is it? Yeah. Uh, is that? Think they'll yeah. ever make it? Make. It oh, make. Back oh, back. I hope so. Yeah, we need Chong Lee. I thought they did. I thought there was was Haya doing them, and then there was a Chong Lee. 
I believe there's oh, a... that's right. There was supposed to be something like that, right? Yeah, Hyatt did, just did the Rambo, and I, I believe they're doing a Bloodsport. And I remember seeing a Chong Li somewhere, and I was like, oh, man, I can't wait for that one. Keep going, you will start. Okay. Right. No, no, no. It's okay. So now you get to see the, the, posing, whoop, the posing hands. He's so... Man. He's so tall. He's I so... really... Ah! Oh, gosh. Sorry for shaking. Oh boy, there we go. I knocked my Ooh. camera off. <laughs> what a quick you know, like, fix! What right, that was that was a bad. That was a bad. <laughs> actually, now look at look at this. I feel like the lighting is a little bit better now on it. Okay, this, this so. actually, and on purpose, Yimo. Know, that's a great <laughs> new skit. <laughs> Drop the phone, so, and then it's revealed a better thing. Yeah, Machuto's so syndicate is the line. Syndicate, that's, that's right. Yeah, that's right. They look great um, too. Those look great. <laughs> Still mad Frank Duck splits lost in the talkies. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at this guy. Oh my god. <laughs> well, this is gonna be where the jokes come in. Uh those chairs were made for the large packing boys. So <clears throat> number one, let's talk all right. So I'm not too worried. Again, like I'm not gonna complain about it because that depending on where he's getting punched, like look at the blood. It's it's just really great. Um the double jointed elbows. Now I did heat him up, so he is. I got him all nice and loose. He's got double jointed knees. I mean, he moves really well. And the thing that blew me away. So the crunch, crunch is still limited. <clears throat> I feel like again, this is a company that is actually actively listening to the collectors and guys like us that are like in the posing business. So that's not a ton, but I can still do the McFarlane torso mod. So that's that's what I plan on doing. The biggest pro outside, so double jointed elbows, and then the other one, guys, drop down hips on oh, a diamond really? select. Wow! wow. Actually, Look I think at Vision that. might have those too. Yeah, they start. Does it? Does Vision it. have it? Okay, and I love that Vision too. Like he's up on my um, Avengers shelf. I love that figure. But drop down hips that really blew me away. And now, okay, so this is, oh, I don't know if it was an oversight. I didn't, uh, what's up? I said negative vision does not. Okay, so that's what I'm saying, man. Like this, this totally blew me away. I was like, is this, this is for real? Wow. Now, I posted my unboxing reel. So excited, recorded it last night in my kitchen. I was just like so amped to like get this guy going. And the every comment. <laughs> just do it. Just do it. And then show it. Don't yikes! Yikes! <laughs> he, this is this. Can we put the blur? Like two is, times the fun. Yeah, both. This is a family show. A, yeah. Put <laughs> These are pegs, gentlemen. These are pegs. But if you want to know why Jean Claude Van Damme is so incredibly alpha, now we know. Now we know. <laughs> 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 oh, no. Machu at the center of the double beach. <laughs> All right, so you have to hit that checkbox that says "not for kids." Uh, no, because it's it, these are pegs on a toy. Everybody, these are pegs on a toy. There is no. Nope, this is we're all good. Can you bring up Machu's last uh, comment? <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Now, no, that's a, that you know. <laughs> Guys, I still remember when I bought this Gundam marker at the Hobby Lobby yeah. during our Chris Con weekends. So yeah. this has come in so handy so many times, including that Donnie I just showed you guys. So the the two mods that I plan on making are obviously now going to be, I'm, and I'm not going to do the entire thing, but really it's not going to take much. And I will say, like, you guys were the ones in Machu, like, don't use a black permanent marker because it does dry weird and shiny and it right like a purpley kind of yeah. way but look look already i'm already i'm not even i'm just doing it lazily and it's already just a piece is gone yeah, yeah he's already back to normal human status Listen, he didn't have a lot of money his shorts had a rip in it okay <laughs> <laughs> it's not the shorts that make the fighter <laughs> right so this is how quick i'm just trying to show you guys like for those of you if you're on the fence or got annoyed about the flesh colored Pegs. Um, like said tip. Yeah, it is. This is a very fine tip <laughs> gun to marker. But really, like that's all it's going to take, and it's not done. And like I'll, I'll, I'll spend probably what another five minutes or so, like off stream, and there yeah. we go. So it's, it's nothing not to be noticeable, anyways. Yeah. Well, in the splits, it was. 
the splits. Yeah, hold on, split. can I? Can I? I got it. I got it. Hold on, I'm not gonna do it here. Hold on, I oh, got. Because I, oops, sorry, Chris. Oh. Oop, I got I got to show you. I hope you guys don't mind. I usually don't do this, but I cracked myself up because I found again. I every once in a while I like to rotate in those goofy um, uh, cap cut templates, and I'm like. Is there a Jean Claude Van Damme one? Like I thought that there was gonna be something like Is there really angry there mean and uh oh, it was the dancing this. one. The dancing, <laughs> the dancing one. one. Yeah, yeah. That's the best so, one. That's, that's my Jean Claude Van Damme right here. Give me dancing. Yep. So that <laughs> big pants but that's, and dancing. That is genuinely though, like how excited I was when I discovered all of the articulate. Look at him. Look look at him balanced, man. But yeah, it was it was glaring. It was glaring. Um, and you know who else? I think it was Spider Man nineteen seventy four. Is that his name? Yeah, yeah. Hold on. Yeah, but I gotta tell you the one that that's also funny because I I haven't checked your um your comment section. For, there we go. Uh, JCVD, but um the the other reel that you did of Sabretooth and Wolverine, and you're just your head just pops up. Yes. That got me. Dying. <laughs> That's what that I was, was hoping. That's what I was, was hoping. That was a good one. <laughs> uh, but yeah, here we go. Spider-Man 1974. Look at with the balanced uh, coffee yeah. cups there. That That's is amazing. Yeah. And he also, you know, while we're on his page, another diamond guy. We might have to invite him to the diamond, the diamond boy club. But did you see his showcase? Of this figure? He the, the, even his write up, wow. his write up. Like, I'm an ELA teacher. And I'm just like that. That made me so excited to open this up. Like, yes, it stands at a pr it stands proud at seven inches. While size can be a pivotal factor for some, this figure transcends mere dimensions. It's the definitive Captain America, a centerpiece in any collection for twenty nine dollars, complete with two shields. Blah 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 blah. blah. It's like, oh, he fired me yeah. up. Yeah, cool. fantastic. Look at this work, right? Oh, it looks like an incredible figure. It really does. Yeah. It really it's it's definitely something special like it's different from any of the design at least looks so just so good and it's yeah. uh i'm treating it a lot differently than my other diamond ones so <laughs> permanent marker will turn purple or blue exactly that's what that's what you guys had warned me in my you know so the next one um let's see <laughs> i'm ruining the best part <laughs> you, gotta put the, you gotta put the two machos together <laughs> uh wait which one Oh, in time. Oh, yeah. He's going to have blue ball joints. <laughs> Steven go. Morrow, mazel tov. <laughs> quick press. Oh, that's good. That's good. That's good. <laughs> Why does this guy want to fight me? Oh, my God. Yeah. So, I guys, I mean, like, I wish at this, at this angle where I'm sitting, it's not, like, ideal to get into, like, trying to, like, do some posing with him, like, you know, but, like, he can move and just it's it's fun i, I gotta do more stuff with them um now after i you know let that stuff dry you could see you know with the heat there we go he's he'll, he'll be able to hold there i was worried for a second that i was gonna have to add, add some kiki but nope yeah he's set man like this is All a right. cool it's everything that we were expecting and more like and you know we knew that it was going to be a cool looking toy no matter what but to actually have a lot of fun factor like genuinely a lot of fun factor and uh just in the posing area because you know like I, we always enjoy the, the stuff that comes in but yeah just in the posing department i'm so pleasantly surprised do, they get i know your face is kind of uh painted weird on that eye but i am so happy they gave him the face where he gets the blind dust in his eyes yeah and he's just looking around like that, well, uh, that's why I don't I don't mind it too bad. I really great. like yeah, like this. Like I said, it uh, it is not like I, it might not even be misprinted. I'm I'm wondering how it's going to look on yours, Chris, when it comes in. And even if it does, like I said, just from a photography standpoint, it's it's fine. Like look, even just from there, it's yeah. no big deal. You know, like any kind of just maybe straightening ahead. You know, but that's they're toys. We have to, we've had to deal with this many times. But man, uh, it's he's so much fun though. Oh man, he looks so fun. I like need to get going. Oh, get going with uh, posing him in a photography sense. Hang on, let me get the. 
the now I will say it it is tough. It was tough a little bit at first to um here we go. I'll, I'll try to do something. Machi's like saying it's hard to see on the phone how the mm. eyes are. Oh, on his phone. Never mind. Okay. I thought you were saying the phone that you're using or the camera you're using. There we go. Let's just sit him up nicely. Oh, nice. There we go. Oh, yeah, chill for a second. A little post fight. Um, trying to balance him. Like, it is balanced. Like, that's why I was really blown away when I saw that coffee cup shot because. Like it did take me a little bit to get him balanced, and that's where obviously they do include the posing stand. So behind him, this is where the peg is, and it actually. Oh yeah, no, it's it's just gonna be there. But yeah, so there's the posing spot, but it, you know, not obtrusive. And now let me try to dig out Evil Ryu for a second, so I can do that Storm Collectibles uh, comparison for Captain McKay. Cool. Now. Oh. Wouldn't it be awesome if they did a whole JV, JCVD series? So, like, they'd Bloodsport, maybe they'll do Kickboxer, maybe they'll do um, his most notable role, Time Cop. I would love to have a JCVD Time Cop. Anyone else? What other movies do you think we could have? Street Fighter. Street Oh, Guile. Okay. There might be some licensing issues there, but maybe. Yeah, it's just him in the in the outfit. <laughs> Got it. Commander. Commander mm -hmm. JCVD. I'm going to go. No, Commander. I'm, I'm going to go to his uh, IMDB so we can look at his his roles. And why nice do you do that? Um, Steve Morrow asks, uh, do you have 112 sunglasses and he for a Johnny Cage? Oh, that would be sick. He'd be a really good Johnny Cage. That'd be a perfect Johnny Cage. Didn't, what did they do with him? Didn't he just do something where he did appear? Oh, the video game, right? Wasn't it in the Mortal Kombat game? He, he Oh, that's what it was. He was in the Mortal Kombat game. Who? Jean-Claude Van Damme, I thought. Like, the, the latest he one. I, he was? Yeah, like, I remember seeing his finishers and fatalities, and it was pretty uh, awesome. As a character? Yeah. Like, was he himself, I mean? Yes, he was himself, but like, but God, also I going up against Johnny Cage. Friendship mode is him dancing. <laughs> oh, that's a great. Oh, that'd be great. <laughs> Can't be mad at me. Look at me. Like the, yeah, that dance. Oh, man. Yeah. All right. So here's for Captain McKay. Imagine if they mo cap that one. <laughs> that's all I want now. <laughs> I'll buy so, a PlayStation 5 just to play that game. <laughs> By the way, we, we, I, I would love he's to just, show. He's a little skinny compared to uh, Ryu. Ryu. But... but all right. So I will. So yeah, from the Street Fighter, from this particular character, he's definitely tiny. But I'm thinking like my reptile figure is more slender. Don't you have some of the you have some of the ninjas, right? The Mortal Kombat guys, Sunsy? Two? Yeah, I have three of them. Scorpion okay. and uh, reptile, I think, from Mortal Kombat 3. And I got Ermac from uh, 2. Okay, so yeah, I think that the the reptile. I mean, the reptile was always a like a more svelte version of Ryu, so I think it would play a little bit better. And you could see height wise, I feel like that that would work. So maybe not this matchup in particular, but I feel like the Mortal Kombat guys. Oh man, like Machu's Liu Kang. I think Liu Kang would go up perfectly. Like he was actually the smallest of the Storm collectible figures in the Mortal Kombat range that I've seen. So, you see, uh, oh, he's Brown, a... um, his comment about Wait, okay. Storm losing MK. I did see that a lot of people. I saw. I, I felt bad for um, you know our community members that were into this line. They were super annoyed because they never get, got any female any female figures from the line, right? Mm -hmm. Or mm -hmm. yeah, and it was a big line. I don't. Did they ever do a Sonya Blade? I don't think they did. And then like none of the other ninjas or anything you would think sonya would be one they do in the first wave or something yeah but alas I wonder if they're losing the license that must mean someone else is getting it that's what i'm thinking but who oh, jada? jada i mean speaking of jada they're doing what? a good job everywhere else so that's right so uh captain mckay hopefully that helped for you in you know again with reptile i'll have to dig him out somewhere um 
Oh, going back to JCV. Uh, I have number. him. Oh, right there. How does he look? I have him. He was in the same box. Okay. Whoop. Damn it. <laughs> this is why I have to figure out a better. I have to figure out a better system. I'm like, yes, this table's next to me, but I gotta, I gotta do. <sighs> Son of a bitch. What were you saying, Chris? <laughs> Uh, I was just going back to the JCVD uh, universe in terms of the next diamond uh, character that they should do. Time Cop was up there. Uh, weapon. Uh, so, oh, where was it? Weapon. Omega Weapon 13. He says, and I totally agree, his appearance in No Retreat, No, Res no Surrender. If you want to see like the worst movie ever made. You should watch that movie. It's pretty fantastic and how bad it is. <laughs> so what do you guys think for this one? And I haven't seen that. Uh, but yeah, maybe. <laughs> yeah, don't. I was, it's it's terrible, but it's it's good. But it's good. <laughs> so what do you think? Does that work a little bit better than the Ryu? The Ryu is definitely... See how Reptile is smaller, but... A little bit better. I mean, Ryu is bigger, but yeah. Uh, what about Street Fighter? Do you have any... I mean, never mind. It's seven inch. So, I was yeah. Oh, Fire Jada. The Jada stuff. Might be a little short. Uh, they'll be short. They'll be short. Do you want me to try? I can go. I can grab. Sure, I know sure. where they are. All right, here. I'm going to yeah, take this going. down. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> All right, hang on. Here we go. Um. Well, while we're on Jada, this figure is so much fun. And so is this one. My, I left more wave. Uh, yeah, I'm waiting for he ha hasn't come yet, uh, Captain Cold or Ca uh, Cold Man. But I have to say, I left this out on the on the ottoman, and I took a shower, came back down, and my daughter was playing with it, and she goes, "Dad, both of them, they were playing with this one, and the other one was playing with this one. They're like, Dad, these are fun, and I was like, Yeah, they are fun. He's like, You. Uh, my oldest did, never really talk about articulation or anything with them, but my oldest was like, you can really move his arms all around, and it it really is really good articulation. I was like, oh my god, dear, right here, right. Um, this is happening. <laughs> but it, it, what I love about them is that both my kids picked them up. I'm like, wow, this is fun. These are fun. These are just fun figures. Go grab it. I start to pick one up. I oh, I highly recommend. Well, I shipped my pile of loot. I finally did it. Nice. Because, yeah, because like, pressure. yeah, it was the peer pressure. But in all honesty, like, what was I gonna do? Was I gonna keep sitting around waiting for Noir and Big Bad? Like, I have a lot of goodies in there. So I should now, I granted, to add something to my pile. Granted, I will say that I shipped it today, so that means it won't even like process for <laughs> however long. <laughs> Yeah, but um. Okay, so what are you buying, Andrew? Hold on, I want to buy it before I say it. We oh. we had this happen before. <laughs> oh, on on the stream, <laughs> someone sniping you for it. <laughs> oh, it must be good. No, no, it's it's, it's in a while. Well, yes, it is cool, but oh, that Chung Li is so tempting. Oh, <laughs> you don't have her yet? No, I I. I'm not sure if I want to go all in on the Street Fighter line. Oh, dude, I'm I am all in on them, but he is taller. Not you made a good point. Here. Yeah, yeah, he's yeah. Actually, that is funny. Um, <laughs> yeah, he's significantly larger than those guys. But Machu made the good point. McFarlane Mortal Kombat. I do have a Liu Kang from that set. So he would be the only one that would make sense. But I think he would fit the best. Unfortunately, he's not in this bucket. And I think all my, my magic tricks are gone of like making figures appear. <laughs> so, <laughs> I have no idea where that uh, where that one is. But yeah. So there we go. If you guys were interested, on the Diamond site, um, he's listed at $24.99. Just as an FYI, and then Amazon is, I think, pre-order was maybe thirty four ninety nine. I think you're right, right? Because I was trying to look at it, but uh, you know. So either way, you know, either option can't go wrong. Um, but yeah, let's see. 
So Cal was saying Lionheart, Universal Soldier. Ooh. Here, oh, let's bring up. Here we go. I have the uh, I have the IMDb up. You want to have some yeah, fun with this it. one? All right. Yes. So here we go, chat. Let us know. Also, I just ordered. Um, I didn't realize it was kind of hard to find until I started searching elsewhere. But um, it's a it's a Master of the Universe figure. Uh, it's a cartoon collection, so it's a little taller. So it's in that same style as that Skeletor I got last month of uh, He Man. So. So it's a He-Man figure of that? Yeah, yeah. Oh, nice. But it's starting to become kind of hard to find, so I knew that big bad still had it. So you did it. Yes, add that to my uh, my number on Wednesday. What, what made you think of that one? <laughs> oh, Yimbo's talking about big bad. Oh, I was just God, like, God. Oh, if I don't God. do this now. <laughs> Watch, <laughs> an hour will be gone. <laughs> so listen, we want him as an actor. Right, so just eighty-three roles as an actor. Good for you. All right, let's. Uh... Um, I saw I saw one uh, minions. That's what I want. <laughs> oh, oh Kung Fu well, Panda how three. Far... Who is he playing Kung Fu Panda three? How far back? He's, okay, so he's he's one of the bad guys. Oh, I want it. All right, I have not. Sorry, so Bloodsport. That's where. I mean, yeah. I grew. Like, I still love that movie. Whenever. Oh God, I, I watched that on network tv like probably channel 11 all, all the, time. the time and kickboxer those were the kickboxer, two big ones yeah. for me lionheart was mentioned lionheart. yep that would be a cool yeah yeah um yeah. where else so, double universal impact. soldier you see you saw a double impact it's where they're twins but it's just him oh my god that's awesome <laughs> That's awesome. Double Van Dam, double impact. One's wearing a polo. One's wearing a tank top. Here double dongs, go. double pegs. <laughs> <laughs> last act. He was in Last Action Hero. That's what? I'm trying to remember. It's been so long. Maybe himself. Was Probably he himself? himself. Probably, if I had to guess. Yeah. Um. Oh, Street, Street Fighter, Fighter, of course. Yeah. Time Cop. I know somebody mentioned Time Cop, right? Time Cop, yeah. This, this would be a cool crack. one. I would I would be down for time cop. I'm trying to like where's he looking? There we go. Come on then. Oh, is that the actress from uh Ferris Bueller? Yeah. Uh is it? All right, I was gonna see if there's some <laughs> more outfits, cop. but no, that could be neat. That could yeah. be neat. That would be cool. Cool one. Um Oh wait, where? Oh, what is she? Oh, she is from no. something. She, she, I don't is think that she's not? No, that's Ferris Bueller, right? Is it? Mia Sara. Let's on, see. Go. I know we're just doing the deep dive through. <laughs> uh, ba -ba -ba. Time cop. Nope. No. Ferris Fer Bueller. Yeah. Ferris yeah. Bueller. There you go. Ding, ding, ding. That, My wife has that superpower too, Chewy. No, that's this diamond. Give me this figure. <laughs> <laughs> Time cop? Oh, too far. No, no, too Ferris far. Bueller. Give me a lot oh, of Ferris Bueller. Bueller. Uh, let's see. Phoebe, Phoebe Cats. Is there anything? Is mm -hmm. Kickbox Retaliation. Oh, I don't know. He played, I mean, like, it's him. No wonder, like, I love just having him as a toy because, like, he... He's himself in a lot of these, which is he, bad, which is fine. Himself. It'd be yeah. like owning a Vince Vaughn action figure, right? Like I <laughs> just in a different sense. <laughs> or an Owen Wilson, which actually I do technically have an Owen Wilson. Ex Expendables figure would be neat. Oh, that'd be yeah, that let's see. Yeah, that would work. I wonder Yeah, you know, like it's just another him in military gear. <laughs> I did not watch the Expendables movies. None of them? I got to tell you, for the majority of oh, there he is. TV's entire filmography, I, I think I've seen like two movies. Uh, really? Uh, After running through all of these? That's yeah, understandable, yeah. but... I think it was Time Cop, Street Fighter, Blood Sport, and that's it. <laughs> it's not like it's looking at that's why i was like there's 79 movies as an actor like i definitely yeah, have only seen a lot. handful but the ones that were iconic were truly like spectacular <laughs> like the ones that we gravitate towards <laughs> yeah. i'm just kidding what'd you say wait what 
I said King's <laughs> Om Night yeah. Mahan Family Show. I was, I was laughing at that one. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I like that he uses Nike. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. That's why it still fits. <laughs> What's going on, Brian? Thanks for hanging out tonight, man. Um, let's see. Where, where, where we go? Ender Shadow. How you doing, buddy? Yeah, the king, the king is right, legend. Um, let's see. Lillian Legends. Okay. Diggs Fix has the black and white pick of JCV. <laughs> Luxurious mullet is amazing. Yep. Here we go. Thanks for joining. Alberto, how's it going, man? And um, let's see. That Magneto... Oh, right. <laughs> I get what Machu's saying. <laughs> um, all right, Machu says Toy Father's a psychopath for skipping on Chung Lee. Yes, see. Yeah, you need psychotic to behavior. Yeah. Psychotic. Where, where's yours, uh, Chewy? Uh, it's it's in the detail. It, it's too uh -huh. precious. Yeah. yeah, entire shelf of just Chung Lee's. So you well, I'm. <laughs> did you pass on her? Or did you get her? Oh, I absolutely passed on her. Oh really? Um, so wait, who I'm did not, you have I, from that line? I got uh, Fei Long. That's it. Okay. It's See? only because of Fei Long, you know, after months, so, Machu finally told me I probably got a, a um, a kind of like a bum one, and mm -hmm. so that turned me off on the line. I love him. I think they look great. Yeah. But because of that one experience I had, I'm just like. But that's just one experience. I have you know, two reuse. I know. <laughs> I just did don't you... play with them enough. I thought it was that's good. that's fair i um Can we meet up um let I, me borrow one <laughs> let me see that's what it's like i mean they are they i i told you guys i i, I have this the this was the comic-con exclusive one i i haven't used them though since the summer i did some mortal Kombat. <laughs> no not I'm mortal Kombat. <laughs> capcom <laughs> stuff <laughs> just in general two out of three that's, that's the way people the third one is jimbo <laughs> <laughs> he he, he assumes two out of three people he meets are psychopaths. Honestly, you know, there's one way to go about life. It's okay. <laughs> you accept, you hear about Where some people choose hate, we choose love. Uh, by the way, Machu, one of my friends met John Claude at a bar she was working at, and he was trying to make masses at her. Well, the double. Yeah, we we you know right. we know why he's got a lot of testosterone. <laughs> Kickers Riddle says, I pass on everything, not TMNT. Don't feel so bad, Chewy. I do really you know, like these toys. Happy about keep playing with. What's that? Quick kick. I haven't opened mine yet. He looks awesome. You guys enabled me into him. I <laughs> did, did you it. Get him? Yeah, I well, I have to wait for like for a week. But yeah. So fun. Yeah. Again, even even just for the Shang Chi potential in my head, like fitting them right into like my Luke Cage and Power Man, getting the defenders going. Okay, fair point. This checks all the box of Asian stereotypes, but I love it so much. <laughs> I love it so much. I'm just saying, Chris. It, it, it you know, following the Yimba logic, it, it's it's toy GI toy father. Here we go. <laughs> Finally, sure. yeah. Look at Finally, me. I get if you a figure accurate portrayal of myself, if I'm, I'm allowed to make every bearded white guy with brown hair me, <laughs> then by all means, off, guys. <laughs> they must have gotten a picture of him. Honestly, you guys have been working out. <laughs> <laughs> um. Machu, you know, I mean, hey, respect your decisions, man. <laughs> no, but the stories would have, I'm sure, I'm sure the stories coming out of that would have been something else. Legend, wait for it, dairy. <laughs> <laughs> um, and yeah, so apparently Jean Claude was a skin on Johnny Cage's character, but yeah, his okay. finishers and stuff. That was it. Was really it was neat. It was because it's his voice, it's his likeness. Like it was, it was pretty neat. Was from, it young uh, JCVD or now JCVD? Mm -hmm. I would prefer now J JCBD. <laughs> I really Let's... I really do hope they they had that friendship fatality with him dancing. If I don't play a video with sound, is that okay? <laughs> How does YouTube think, work? I don't think any of that might be okay. <laughs> oh. So don't bother, but But you know what's messed up? We show you can show a screenshot. Right, and show that's fine shot? if we show a screenshot. Of okay, let me get the screenshots going then. It's on the X Men um, 
uh, talk about uh, that at X Men ninety seven previously on X Men. <laughs> previously on X Men. Um, J Shot was showing a clip, and I was like, "Oh God, stop!" <laughs> Took like he did a one and a half seconds, and I think I think we're okay. All right, there he goes. So it's young, young, young man. Okay. Wow, that looks incredible. Right. Um, he has your abs. Look at that. There he goes. Was he dancing? Guys, I'm, <laughs> yeah. I mocap my abs. <laughs> look at him. Look at the different it looks. That's cool. Right. No, that's that. That's no, just in which case, Diamond's, you know, based on that one of those photos when he was celebrating, Diamond got the head sculpt pretty well. Yeah. Mm-hmm. The casual, calm looking face. Yep. I see there's one where he's in a gi. Two. Oh. Has. I don't know if you can see oh, that. okay. Ooh. That one's a little bit cheaper on Amazon. Is that all right? That's good to know. That's good to know. When is that one coming out? Is that that one's out? Oh, oh. No, I'm sorry. no, 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 November. Sorry. Okay, yeah, I think this is the first of the of this articulated version, right? Um, Diggs wants to know if that could work. If uh, Quick Kick could work as an unmasked Laser Man head. Oh man, can you imagine? I but he's Larry Laser Man. Not to say that he can't have that last name and be not be Asian, but just saying that. Um, he wasn't the Asian in my head. So. Who? Wait, wait, okay. Who do you have in your heads? Let's let's As cast. Let's, let's Ooh, cast. You want to cast, sure cast Laser Man real quick? Mm-hmm. Who are you? Okay. Give me. Give us. Oh. Give us your top three Mr. like Mr. actors Mr. that you. Yeah, current Hollywood working actors. I, I don't know. We need why. a voice of um, the cow, best friend, soon to be turned Mudurin. I I have to say Laser Man, and you guys are gonna laugh because Seth Rogen. No. Ryan Gosling, um, Michael Sarah, <laughs> <laughs> and then the cow is Seth Rogen. There we go, done. Cow is Seth Rogen. That's perfect. That would be work. Just so you know, so I just saw. I I haven't seen Michael Sarah work in, or like act in a movie in a long. What felt like a long time. Barbie. I just was he in it. Yeah, was he in Barbie? Oh, Alan. He was Alan. That's <laughs> right. Alan- he I wasn't was like at. Best thing in that. You're right. Okay. Okay. So, God, maybe he was. At, oh, okay. So, the second movie after what I, what felt like a long hiatus because like I used to you know like he was in Rust Development and all the you know super bad and all the thing like I just felt like there was a string of stuff. Scott Pilgrim. Scott Pilgrim. Um, dream scenario. It's oh. on Max right now with Nicolas yeah. Cage. Yeah, so I do a movie club with my friends each week, and my yeah. friend just recommended this one for this week, so I have to watch it. Oh I yeah, saw, we watched yeah, it. Saw, it's uh, it. yes. <laughs> you know what's? Yeah. I just love Michael. You do a toy talk movie review at on Mondays, yeah. and when you do a weekly movie rough. watch with your yeah, with, with college friends, I think yep. that's very funny. <laughs> yep. And then you stream so, Price with us. Yeah, that's my it. Come here yeah. every Sunday going forward. <laughs> That's why I have no time to do anything. <laughs> but this is fun. This is a, this is a, more act sharpening, Chris. Uh, and what's going on, KRS One? How you doing? Um, see, uh, what is that? Simu Lu. So sorry, Simu. Simu Lu. Sounds perfect sorry. casting. <laughs> Simu Lu. That's I need it. an action figure of um his, his best friend from um Kim's Convenience. Oh, um, Kimchi. Yeah, I, I need a kimchi figure. That can be me. I'll be the kimchi. <laughs> what if for if if? But what am I then? What am I in? You can be similarly. I'm giving you. I'm giving you. Uh, you this oh. guy. Oh, I, I, this see, guy. I see. I, see I thought we were still casting in Laser Man. Oh, um. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> well, we have villains. Hey man. Uh, hey man, I, I see as who's like big like uh john john, john cena. cena john cena's hey man Fico hey Matter. man hey man i didn't realize he was well i had to look up the voice cast of that mutant mayhem movie that was such an incredible cast like i he, at first i'm like mondo is that yeah i was like is that who is mondo and it was paul oh, rudd God. and then yeah <laughs> And Seth Rogen was Bebop, and that, you know, and then yeah. yeah, John Cena. I I couldn't hear the John Cena in that 
a, at all. Like I felt like that was really masked was quite like well. Four lines. <laughs> so. Well, fair, fair. Um, but I keep <laughs> making. I keep. There's a bit that I run with my son, where you know my daughter was. You know she got her ears pierced in November, mm -hmm. and I would I would just like randomly. I randomly said like, oh yeah, I, I got. An, I, I had piercings when I was younger. They're, they're both like, no, you didn't. It's like, yeah, I did. It was in my nose. It was at a different time. I was a warthog. My best friend was a rhino. It was cool, though. <laughs> <laughs> they just hate my bit. <laughs> like, they, they hate when I go into that. <laughs> I make Do they just walk away? <laughs> no, my, my son, like, tries to tackle me, basically. He's like, stop it. <laughs> stop lying to us. <laughs> I, I I like that. I like that. Ooh, Machu has a good one for Hey Man. Ooh, Hey Hey Man. You know, yeah. You, you know, honestly, Chris. Yeah, sometimes man. people tell you no, even when the script is so good. So you need to have like runner ups. Okay. Um, runner ups for Hey Man. So yeah. is Matthew McConaughey a runner up? If we can't yeah, get John yeah. Cena, yeah, John Cena is, goes one. Is, if we can't get John Cena, we might be able to get Matthew McConaughey. Yeah, that's exactly <laughs> it. Yeah. By the way, guys, I'll tell you who you can definitely oh. book is our boy Diggs Figs because yes. he's he has a SAG card. So there you I go. Mean, it's on the table. It's on the table. Did you guys see that Charmin commercial? The cutest, to, cutest kid. Wait, does it really that. exist? Like, yeah, it was. We showed it on Toy Talk. Oh, did you? <laughs> yes. I know you were asking them to. I didn't realize you actually got them to like play it. <laughs> we we didn't get him to play it. <laughs> <laughs> um, Clintastic is a master at YouTube and found it, and we played it. It was this Charmin commercial, and he says "squeeze." He's so adorable, so adorable. Oh, yeah, oh, that yeah, speaker no. he says nothing else. Just squeeze. No. Yeah. <laughs> what? He's your group. He can only say a few words. Just make it one. No, it's he's a general. He's an evil. He's one of the fecal matter. Yeah, he's general fecal matter. Yes, General Storm. I thought he's he came. Originally, I thought he was like a uh, swamp thing type character. No. Oh, I don't like it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Majra su like suggests uh, Sita as the Mooderin. Oh, the... that actually would be really good too. Okay, oh, okay. You just have to hire a number of people and then you can slot them with right. the Rocksteady voice. With the Rocksteady voice. Um, yeah, there we go. <laughs> well, who is? Yeah, how many people like didn't uh, Momoa? Did I think he? I think he uh, auditioned for Superman there and then go. they right and then gave him Momoa. got Aquaman. <laughs> Karis one hey storm is back to wear her black punk outfit in x-men 97 that's right that's right um speaking of x-men nice little segue but i just had to show this guy off wow look at those wings dude i know the wings are great guys I, I, yeah i mean i ordered this crap. one last night too it, it's in three parts the wing yeah. And it can fold down beautifully, so like he has a great like down shelf presence. It's on a rotate like a, the peg can fold and flap, but everything is firm. And I said it last night on the X Men stream, but this is everything I wanted the Venom wings to be on that Null two pack. And then he just is Warren is just this is awesome, man. He's got the two great head sculpts, the big smiling one. Oh, it came with two head sculpts. Oh, yeah, yeah. So he's got the stoic. I mean, this is so. Anyway, I am Honestly, super. This is the year I keep forgetting figures. Like, I feel like in years past, I would remember all the things that they would come with, and this is the year where I'm just like, I can't remember any of it. Yeah, well, that's good. It's like a surprise. But look how big this freaking look at this. Yeah, that's it's massive. Awesome. It's massive. Um, so Do speaking of, I don't, I don't, which. I saw Toy Chase had it at the uh, last Toy Con. So if it's, you know, if he still has it, I have to hit him up because Archangel, like when we were talking about comics, like Age of Apocalypse, that was, I read the hell out of that series. Like, you know, yeah. like the Four Horsemen and just like, oh God, I've just, everything that happened to Warren and the creation of Archangel and just, that was amazing from back in the day. So I have those comics somewhere. I got to bust them back out, but. Look at him, nice all folded up. Oh, it's 
it came out great. I mean, yeah, like this is a spectacular, yeah. spectacular figure. He does. He's on the typical like ab crunch, but pinless everything, which you guys know. No throw up in my throat because it's gorgeous. <laughs> like it's just. I know rare. you say that, but every neck of turtle has pins. I know. That's why I joke. I joke. Don't you hate those? Speaking of jokers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> he's back I didn't, from his drive did you have I dinner didn't think that, uh, yeah I had dinner with the family nice. perfect, perfect. happy yeah. easter machu happy easter <laughs> yeah that did you get the angel yet no I did not I'm That's still right, with but, Hasbro okay it, you're gonna <laughs> you're gonna freaking love it man and I probably won't be doing like an in-depth review, but I know Unparalleled has one, so obviously you can go check his work out uh, where he covers this in depth. But it's got the Yimbo stamp of approval, man. Holy crap! I love what do you it. think of the reveals from WonderCon? Oh yeah, we, that, that's another thing I put in the thumbnail description or like in the YouTube description. Like we should talk about WonderCon stuff. I like the uh, Iron Man Mark. Uh, what was it Mark Twenty? Which one was that? Was that I want the chunky boots? That's not the one. I think that's ten or nine or something like that. All right, we got. We're gonna have to pull up. I Who uh, had some good gosh. coverage of it? Yeah, Lago maybe. Did Lago probably put some stuff up? Right. This was also waiting for me when I got home. Oh, oh nice. man, should I get it? Wait, what is it? Oh yeah, Enrock was cool. talking about it. Yeah, I have mine. <laughs> toys. Oh, well, we really love his toys. Chris, hey, I'm gonna. I think you should get him. Yeah, I know he's a Spider Man. Yes, that's dude, Chris. You, I bought Spider Shot because of you. You're because you posted on your threads, like, <laughs> but it's Spidey, and I'm like, you son of a gun. Yeah, all right, fine. <laughs> so I, that's why I ordered him. <laughs> that, that him, and, him and, you and Dan, Spidey. okay. <laughs> you and Dan got me with like just. Ugh. I think he um, literally was in the comics for like four panels. Uh, is he like a Spider Verse one, like during that yeah. crossover? Yeah. Yeah. And it was like literally, he he wasn't even. I don't think he was on a cover or anything. So, so by the way, really obscure. Really obscure. Going back to what you oop, what you guys were mentioning. Shoot, there we go. Yimbo, I'm gonna use this opportunity to tag in with Machu and tag. Yeah, yeah. Of course, uh, man. Chris, it's been a pleasure, man. Love, love, uh, getting that. Spend some time tonight. Love spending some time, Machu. I wish I had a uh, longer time with you. Sorry about that. It's and um. I'll see y'all guys. See you guys. Chris, later. Chris, do you want it? Do you want to encourage Chewy to announce our guest, or are we twisting his arm into that right now? Or is that allowed? Yeah, we we didn't. It, yeah. Oh, do do we, we need to it? confirm it? I think we're good. You know, I'll do it now. And I'll just. All right. I I didn't know Chris if if it was a toy daddy reveal, but okay, we'll wait. It's okay, okay. Chris. Have a great okay. night, buddy. You, you can mess it <laughs> up. Fine. Okay. Go get a right. Chun Li. Yeah. <laughs> I had one in in my hand, and I then I put it back. But. That was silly. What a silly yeah. man! <laughs> Seriously, come on now. Have a great night, Chris. Oh, Happy Easter, buddy. Saw it in person? Yeah. Oh man, he's so he, silly. He's an even bigger psychopath. I mean, <laughs> I've I just haven't bought it from Big Bad. Like, if I saw it in hand, like my target has nothing. I probably would have bought something. Uh-huh. I won't. <laughs> all right see you guys see you later chris right. later chris um by the way i love these comments uh sorry it's covering up machu but yeah there goes Timo. he might actually glide you're right if i give him a nice toss i think he'd get like a little 30 seconds of air uh <laughs> flight time yeah um great wings yeah and josh brown they will definitely do a new archangel that's what i'm figuring too so if toy chase doesn't have that for me then uh then yeah i can probably wait i'm hoping for a new archangel yep and Josh Brown, yeah, get a Chung Lee and a Spear Epic all in. There you go. Yeah. So, Happy all right. Colin. Back. Happy Colin. Happy Colin is. Um, Happy Colin? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. From our four hour stream. That's why I end up doing a hashtag. Like yeah, yeah. That's right. This 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 month's. That, is it going to be for all of uh, April? Not all of April, but I think. For this week? Or? I think maybe the 25th or so. Okay. Sparrow's but, yeah, going. T- I mean, they just started like a week, ago, two weeks ago. No, but I mean, for our TPC, isn't it like the current hashtag TPC underscore? Oh, yeah. Um, Epic All In. Epic All In, yeah. Yeah, Epic there Colin. you go. Epic <laughs> All In. All right. So here we go. This is our boy, uh, Lago Figs, uh, Toy Migo. So 
What do we like from these reveals here? I like Whiplash. I think Whiplash can look great. That's the one I want. Oh, this is neat. Yeah. It's got butterfly joints. Oh, does it? Does it really? Yeah. Looks like it. Yes, right in here. Yeah. yeah, I want so I would he's now I'm kind of leaning towards this guy too. I like She Hulk a lot. I'm definitely gonna get her. Tell um, me that doesn't look like Henrock. It does. <laughs> I think it can work. I think look it can work. Face. First off, you have to tell me who this is. Henrock. Oh yeah, okay. Fine. Yeah. Henrock. Count being the figure. Who's that? Nefaria? <laughs> is that how you is that, that that name? I'm trying to read that from the tiny little thing. But I yeah, mean, I'm it not like a laser man villain. It does for sure. Um, so I'm I, looks good too. And then Whiplash is neat. So um, I was like, I, I know uh, talking to Dan, he was like, yeah, I think I'm gonna Whiplash. I'm like, I'm not familiar with this look. He's like, it was in the show. So like maybe if I go back and watch some of the cartoon, I think it's on Disney Plus. Like this is a cool one, but you know, since I have that first one, I think I could skip. But if I, you wanted to recreate the first issue of Avengers. Mm. You would need that gold. Iron yeah. Mark True. But I, I, is it just me? I love the chunky boots. I like the chunky boots too. Where is this one? Is this just from the TV show? That was just the look of it? Like the. I don't think it's from the TV show, is it? I, th I thought it was one of the armors that's in oh, like it? the. Mm. Yeah. Um, And then who? Oh, did, didn't Unparalleled get to do a bunch of stuff while he yeah, was there? I think he, I think he came home with a figure. Let's see. Let's go check out his stuff. Oh, man. All right. So... I think he was handling the packaged figures. Oh, okay. He was I thought he got to... Yeah, let's see. So model 20. Oh, that does look good. Right? Here, sorry. I can let it linger a little bit. I'm not trying to... <laughs> oh, he did see. He did get to mess with it. That does look like that butterfly really joints good. on an Iron Man. Holy crap. Yeah. That's All right, cool. so he look he looks good. Um. Oh, he. I thought he. I was hoping he was gonna have chunky boots, but hey, She Hulk is alright. Let's do. Yeah, she look how great she looks. I have that. Um, the other original. What comic one was that that I have? I just oh, busted this her out. The gun that bends. Nice. Yeah. That's great. That's cool. You could also get that with the, a lot. I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> fair fair <laughs> you know where i was going with that <laughs> um and shout out to wade for he was getting the uh show off there we go odious was in the house at WonderCon, so that's really awesome um where else could i go for some WonderCon coverage where do you guys think who else um, uh in pursuit i think in pursuit of toys okay let's check I'll bring that or uh, aic i think might have something but I think it's all, you know, foes taken during the presentation. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I guess we could go back to some of these other ones, too, because there's a lot that we, that we, uh, I forgot to talk about the, like, yeah, the McFarlane stuff. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, we don't need those. Oh, boy. That Tim Drake Robin looks really good, too. Not yeah. that I didn't, oh, that Booster Gold. Like, these are, these are freaking neat, man. Master, we got time. All right, this is this are, is the line are, that we were all. Those are next year, so we're good. We're we got time. Oh, it, oh that's right. <gasps> Wait, they're doing a tumbler. Yep, two pack. You got you oh, got um man. Oh, what's the character with name? Lucius? Lucius. Oh, Lucius Fox. boy, this that penguin, penguin looks awesome. Actually, this this line, I I this I'm picture. All, I will yeah, after. yeah, all three of these. Yeah, but I'm penguin, very actually. Oh, it, it hits me so, so good. Yeah. <laughs> and the boomerang with the jacket, that picture was awesome. Yeah. That was that, the, the product reveal. And then Starfire, that's a great looking Starfire. Um, and then Bruce, yeah, we'll they're back, doing... Back one. What? One, one critique is, I, is that digital? That was a figure. I, that's yeah that's why i skipped over it i'm not yeah, like, go on, go i'm on, not addressing it. any of that todd stuff because i don't want no no thank you get real plastic real toys mm. um so the, so bruce is bruce is a is a build-a-figure then presumably right if it's a build-a-figure wave 
Yes. Yeah. Okay. Wait, is it? Is that what it says? That's what it says on the top over here, articulated build a figure waves. So I mean I'm hoping, like I said, about Alfred was a standalone. I'm really hoping that they just make Bruce. A I know standalone. Barbara Gordon was um the slate like the civilian version is slated as a uh, build a figure. So maybe that's how Todd's sliding oh yeah. That's how Todd's um moving them through. Okay. I want that I phantasm would... though. I think that looks good. Yeah. Yeah. And then that's great. I'm gonna get that. Again, I don't have no space for more vehicles, but I want it. I've, and I've been avoiding this line too. Even though I have the Alfred, I've just yeah. It's tough. They're fun, and the the thing that's better about them is that, like this will fit, presumably, like if you have that Mafex one, or we were talking about the Mezco one potentially. You know, like. I, this there's they're more in they're at least in scale size wise typically with like what we those are five inch. play with what the the batman ones aren't those five inch no they're they're bigger they're six inch wait oh, yeah. which one the animated ones like these guys these are not like the bruce the uh batman oh, 66 six yeah i thought they were smaller for something. no that's the um, batman 66 that well, this is what replaced it like batgirl and well yeah robin's robin. tiny even Nightwing is a little smaller, but Batman, Joker, some of the villains, they're all six inch or above. I just I think they could work. I, I, I'm i surprised though that we're getting this before the Batman animated series. Like that's another one that I'm that's right up there with the Keaton Batmobile. It's only a matter of time. I know. All right. So these are the ones. Oh I have this Deadpool still from the two pack with um Teenage Negasonic. Um yeah. but this has removable guns in the holster. Again, this is just a great option. I love that when they do this stuff for people like wanting to get these toys. So good oh, on them for um, having this single. This one I don't have, so I can't wait to buy this Wolverine. That's While we're one. on Hasbro, I did get confirmation about this Wednesday. Uh, for those in the chat, this Wednesday we'll have a special guest from the G.I. Joe Classifieds team, as well as many other brands that she's worked on. But we'll have Emily from um, the Joe's team joining us. Yay! See, I oh, I bought a soundboard and I didn't get it set up because I think it's not going to work with my setup. <laughs> oh, you, you, it would have been perfect. You had that and you had the uh, GI Joe. Do 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 do. That would yeah. Oh, I'm so stoked. That's great that that's confirmed Did, now. So anybody get the the Scarlet yet? No, no. I haven't seen it in person. She's really she's really good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <sorry. laughs> there you go. Take that out there. But Josh oh, Brown's excited. There we go. Um, and yes, yeah, see, look, King Eternal said it was a six inch, you know, the six inch articulated line on the okay. top with that build a figure. So yeah. Uh Karis one likes that penguin. Everybody like that penguin is that that's yeah, a must have. Spot on. Yeah. Um Josh Brown said, I have that old Hasbro Fantastic Four exclusive She Hulk, but we are in desperate need of a new one. Yeah, I have the it's the green one. And she had the two head sculpts. She's a great, you know, tattered shirt with the ripped pants. Like she's a great yeah, oh, there was figure. Even one right before that too. That was more comic accurate. Okay. In the in the in the onesie. Yeah, Karis one is hopping on that She Hulk for sure. <laughs> Wade's a shill. <laughs> <laughs> that's great. We didn't say it, but I'll, I'll, I'll sound by it. <laughs> with no context just that <laughs> oh hey, look a lot we got jukebox hero what's going on man and then figure report i still have to lock down a date for mikey to join us on one of these sunday nights mikey i'll send you the link right now man if you feel like but that's oh, I, that's yeah. not supposed to be a lot of pressure like if you're just you know you might he, be feeling a little he what? also got hell divers you know. Oh, did he? I still have to buy it, man. I, I know. I'm a jerk. That. I got to get it. I got to get it. This but yeah, Mike, you're just saying. You're always more than welcome. Um, but yes, we got to lock down a day. Like, you know, if, if not tonight, Mikey, again, it's Easter. <laughs> this is just us chilling. Um, you know, that's a future future guest over here. Um, but yeah, so Emily, that's going to be so amazing, dude. I can't wait to... Matt, you got this set too? Or this guy? Yeah. yeah. I got him because he looks like Dr. Disrespect. Yeah. <laughs> Which, which I do it, yeah, yep, for sure. I, I, I mean, like the freaking jetpack and the rockets. I mean, like this guy's insane. The only thing I didn't like about that though is the um, <laughs> the rockets are always in firing mode because you can never just house them in. Wait, you can't. I'm, I'm surprised you haven't. You could tried. take them off the. You could take them off the smoke trail. Yeah, but they fit in the actual housing. 
Oh. That's right. something that I feel like that's a, something that that's a bummer. I feel like they usually think about something like that. That's like a missed yeah. opportunity there. That was. Oh, well. Take your report. <laughs> He's in a oh. end stream. <laughs> <laughs> that's fair, man. Thanks for, hey, we just appreciate it's, you hanging hey, out, buddy. It's okay. You and you and Dario can watch streaming while, you know, in the top. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Messi says, quick random question. Haven't seen any posts from you guys, so I was wondering, um, do you guys have the Gucci Moon Knight? Um, I don't, but you guys I both do. do. Yeah. I do in a box. I don't. Oh, wait. Oh, Machu doesn't have it. Okay. You want me to open it? Yeah, open it. Do it. There we go. But yeah, make him. There you go. It's in, in, in the honor of Mikey, too, right? Yeah. <laughs> Because over here, we, this is a very pro Moon Knight stream for the record. I know I enjoyed that show. <laughs> We're going to keep t uh, teasing uh, Show Wade, <laughs> which is not, which I am not. I, not my words. Not my words. <laughs> Can't wait to send some clips. No, I'd like to still be back. Like we, we, I'm, I'm tentatively invited back. No, I'm tentatively invited back uh, at the end of April. So I don't want to. Oh, yeah? I don't want to blow that. <laughs> But yeah. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Yeah, let's do it, baby. No, John. No, no, no. I said I just read your words. <laughs> no, I, I did hear you say it, though. Yeah, I, I oh, wasn't okay. looking down at the time. I can neither <laughs> confirm nor deny. I was. All right. So, although although Josh Brown did send me a, a May Day, so I, I don't know. I don't know, Yumbo. Well, I, I know. I, never, I have to tell. I never got a May Day. <gasps> oh, it's okay. you're gonna make Josh sad. <laughs> it's okay. Um, it's okay, question man. for you guys. We'll send you ours so you can paint it. For <laughs> so us. you can, so I can paint it for <laughs> you. you it yeah, there you go. Oh, that's true. That's true. Uh, you know, uh, Josh. So Josh sent me one because he's the yeah. awesome. And then um, I was again. I, I told this story a couple weeks ago, but just for the benefit of the you macho. So then. Um, my my, I was like, oh yeah. My daughter was like, oh, daddy, can I paint it? I was like, no, I'm gonna let mommy handle this one. Uh, and then in in that conversation, he's like, oh, I'm gonna send her one. And he's like, but you have twins, right? So then he sent me two. I know my son. Like, you can probably take my sons, if Josh, if you want. I can I can just pass one along. I don't think my son is really gonna mind if, but my daughter will definitely paint the crap out of her May Day. So. Maybe I should test the waters first, Matt. Test the waters if, first. I'll test yeah. the waters because you know what? Again, twin dad, I'm like, they, I don't want get, you to they get so competitive over the weirdest stuff. <laughs> it's not even twins, Ian, but like, I know. I are know. two years apart. Holy <laughs> crap. They go from like loving each other intensely to being like, you're my new enemy. <laughs> <laughs> the funny thing is, all right, long villain that I will fight you. <laughs> uh, Josh said that they, 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 they're a bit of a dude. Like his work is his his uh printing work is awesome. Again, go check out Josh's uh custom page. It's really check great. Check out his store too. Yeah. Um, is everything okay, Machu? You don't have the Gucci Moon Knight, says Diggs Uh I just didn't like the look of that Moon Knight. That's why I didn't get it. You know which one I if I had gotten it early on with um. There's the alternate faceplate, right? The black, but that one yeah. doesn't. But you yeah. had to pre-order. That was the pre-order exclusive, I think. Uh, yeah, you had to pre-order it somewhere. Uh, probably Genki. Okay, that would have been a neat look. Again, I mean, I've seen amazing pictures with it, Messi. Yeah. So you can't go wrong. I mean, like the fact that it looks so good is why I'm buying. I bought the Batman Arkham Knight because I'm like, look at what they're doing now with these yeah. cloth capes and everything else, you know. And that's supposed to be coming out. In September, I believe the Batman one, the Arkham Knight. Oh, okay, that's yeah, that's where we Arkham were going. Oh. Right. Yeah, well, it is Arkham Knight Batman. Arkham Knight is already out. Like, I've had that one for a while. Oh, I hope they reissue him. Um, he's a good one. Yeah. So wait, which one did I order? Is it the? Oh, Batman. Arkham. Oh, Arkham, Arkham Knight Batman. Batman. Arkham yeah. Knight is another. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, duh. <laughs> fair, fair, fair. Um. All right. So we have. Chewy opening, Rebel Tech Moon Knight. Okay, Machu, what do you? I'll do it with the plastic. Try and get okay. this. Take stuff your time, Machu. What are you uh, playing with right now? I was playing with the uh, saber tooth and Wolverine, but a uh, yes. Yamaguchi Wolverine. Okay. I'm jealous you have them. 
I'm in the same it's chat so where you where you claimed them. I was like, damn, I was too late. Yeah, I'm trying to. I forgot the name of. Who is it? Uh, I'm trying to look it up right now. Was, J, was it JCS? Yeah, that articulation. Hops that and Heroes. Uh, oh, Hops and Heroes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout out to Hops and Heroes, but yeah. Yeah, Carol's one cool Revo. Yeah, it is. Was, it's a good he, one. That like I I've been looking for, but I'm always afraid of buying it because buying it online, some if you don't trust the source, you might mm -hmm. get a knockoff. Yeah, yeah, that's why I haven't bought it from um, yeah. eBay. Well, um, the figure report, Mikey says, uh, I'm uh, the the Moon Knight. I believe it's a great figure. That tactical look meshes well with Gucci's aesthetic. I believe that's the one he was talking about, but. Yeah. Yeah, that that um it does look good. Here we go. Let's, let's look at this pose. Again, you get that extra articulation, oh, man. That. Yeah. That's gnarly. I love it. I love it. Um all right, so you guys have a couple of toys in hand. So should I unbox a thing? I have Speaking of Retro Joes, I have the uh the Duke. I oh, think this yeah, is going to be my good. first Duke. That Duke looks good. I have the tiger striped one with the uh, the motorcycle. I have I have this. Yeah, I have the same Duke though, like the uh, the retro one. So a, I have a bunch of figures on my desk. If you can't tell, I'm just pulling them out. Oh yeah, <laughs> but like he has a nice articulation scheme on the torso. Well, I ended up also getting this guy, and he was one. He he kept my um, when I was cutting purging some of my Joes. Who is that? Pre orders. This is uh, Franklin Airborne Tall Tree. And I got him because I have the dragonfly coming. And I figured yeah, I'm going to need right. another. Oh, I forgot you got the Haslab. Nice. Yeah. So did I. I don't you know got two of them, it. right? I'm going to hang that from, from the ceiling, probably. <clears throat> does so that I come got... the summer? Or is that like December? I, I don't know. Maybe the summer? The dragon suplex. Oh, nice. And then you could use a oh, um, can of beams. Oh, uh, dragon sloop flex. That's nasty. The slam effect. Yeah, for afterwards when he actually hits the hits the mat. Oh yeah. I gotta wear that from Can of Beams, or I gotta print some myself. Just just get it from Can of Beams. Support support a fellow maker. No, I I still buy from him, <laughs> <laughs> but I have a three D printer right here. <laughs> Yeah, you're you're part. You are a, uh, your own customizer now too. <laughs> um, or do you guys want me to see me build Rhinox from Yolo Park? So whatever you guys are interested in, Joe's pose, Chewy Tombstone. Look at this cape. It's That's, the same yeah. cape as Thor, I believe, but it's just such an impressive. Piece oh, of I still have... By you the still way, have Thor, right? You didn't open Thor, right? Oh no, Thor's up. I opened them. I played them with them for like ten minutes, and they went. Yimbo didn't shelf. open them. No, I haven't opened. No, my Thor's up there. You just reminded me though, it's because I'm gonna go pee and let you guys run the show for a second, and I'm gonna grab Goblin and Spidey Mezcos. That's who I yeah. wanted to talk about. Oh, and so yeah. they're upstairs, and I. Oh my god, I'm so. Oh, so I'll be back. Hang on. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna open this uh, tombstone while he, while he's gone. Nice. I am. Hey, um, who asked for this? Uh, messy. I'm impressed. No, it's a good figure. It's just sorry, Mikey. I just I'm not I'm not huge on Moon Knight. I mean, if I see it in a show, I might pick it up. I'm not huge on Moon Knight either, but I I, mean, I am kind of getting huge on Rebel Tech this year. Uh, who's next? I think Winter Soldier's next. Bucky's next. No, I think uh, Venom. Oh, Agent, Agent Venom. Venom. Yes, yeah. yeah, you're right. I think that's June. And then it'll go. It's June for that, and then depending on what people order, I think Stitch and Jesse from uh, Toy Story, and then Winter Soldier, then Batman. Yeah, Mikey. If it was the, uh, if it was more closer to the look from the show, I probably would have gotten it. That with the wraps, I just did it like the armored look. That's right yeah but he looks great he does 
And I was testing out the legs. It doesn't have that leg issue that sometimes uh, Mason Yamaguchi has. Which one, the, where it pops off? Yeah. But this one feels tight. It feels more like um, Deadpool 2.0. Ooh, I do like that. Oh, my God. I had Deadpool posed on above my detail. Yeah. I just found him on the floor. His leg, like, oh. underneath my desk. I was like, oh, no, please go back in. It just exploded. He just, I think his leg, uh, his leg popped off. That <laughs> happened to me. <laughs> so that happened to me with the uh, Venom, like the the bulky looking Venom Yamaguchi. Yeah. And I think it was actually during a live stream or a, like post live stream. And he just exploded all over the floor. All the joints. Just oh, exploded. he's loaded. He has a lot of joints. So. Yeah, because I mean, he's, it's rebel tech. I mean, all he fell over because he's very top heavy. Oh, that's interesting. I'm yeah. taking off the face right now, and the way it's set up, you take off the hood. So. Yeah. Okay. And so, the hood is a loose piece, so you pop it off, and then you take off the face. Yeah, then you take off the face, but it just. It's just the faceplate. It's not just like a hood on top of a head. Yeah. It's a hood on top of a peg. But the oh, way it goes, okay. actually, I think I'm going to remove the... Without the hood on, maybe I just need to play with it. You can get that face all the way looking straight up. Mm -hmm. And I'm back. How was How, the paint? So, it was, was wonderful. It glorious? <laughs> it was. <laughs> um... So here, just catch up. I know you guys are looking, but just a shout or some chat out. Here we go. Um, yeah. doo -doo. I'm sorry. Oop, there we go. Gucci Black Panther is Muy Bueno too. Yeah, we all have that one. That's yeah. that one's great. Um, ooh, I need El Duke. I scored torpedo, bazooka, and two Cobra officers for 55 today. All right, nice haul. For 55, <laughs> nice. What did we do? Wait, what did you guys do? Because <laughs> I I didn't get that Moon Knight. And then I told him, like, if it looked if it looked more like how it does on the show, I probably would have gotten it. Wait, instead. wait, wait. Why you're all dead to me? I complimented that it's okay to watch us while in the tub, and I have the moon night. <laughs> right. That's true. Should it be all Ace all three? <laughs> These two, yeah. Uh Omega Weapon 13 says only moon night I want is the Phoenix Force Moon Knight. I'm trying to think of what that look is. Did you get the Phoenix Force? That I don't know. Let's see. I do like this tombstone figure. I mean, he's a guy in a suit, right? But suit looks great. You can't really move him that much, but like he's I think he's on a ball joint on the waist. Yeah. He's on a ball joint on the waist. Right? Ooh, check that out. Oh, Sorry, that's that the Phoenix cool. Force. Okay, yeah, it does be, look pretty I would, awesome. <laughs> I would get that one actually. Yeah. And Henrik just said, "I opened a patata. What is that? Patata rapita? A quick potato. A quick potato. <laughs> quick potato. Um. So wait, what were you? We, wait, what were we just holding up? Sorry, Matt. What were you we just showing off? Oh, no, the tombstone. tombstone. He he's on a ball joint on the waist. Oh, nice. So no crunch. Is it like the Power Man? I didn't open my Power Man actually. Yeah, the Power Man has just a one big torso. Yeah. Um, but that was with the you know again it makes more sense in a in a suit body for that so that's great. Okay. Yeah, Henrik says Tombstone is fire and oh, okay, LOL quick kick. <laughs> uh... Fair, 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 fair. Okay. Um, I need that quick kick. Yeah, he's he's up on Amazon. I haven't added him to like my he, list, but it, yeah, you should add him to your list. I he's um besides oh, shipwreck yeah. Yimbo, Quick Kick is my favorite. I'm excited. Yeah, I'm excited to get him. I'm gonna add him to. Let's see, he's gonna show up for me. It says between April sixth and April eighth. Yeah, that's the thing. I don't want to. I'll be I'll be gone. Oh, that's right. I don't want to wait. Wait a second. Mine says free delivery April third. Hmm. Well, maybe. That's... I mean, nope, we, now we... it says April fourth. Hmm. And what what day? 
I'm leaving we'll on the floor. Oh, you're leaving the floor. Just yeah. pick him up uh, while you're away. Yeah. He might be there. Well, yeah. if anybody's interested in Quick Kick, Quick Kick and want to wait, I added it to my G.I. Joe section of my Amazon storefront. So there you go, guys. <laughs> oh, April 11th. I know he's in Targets now, but the um, 60th anniversary soldier, Matt, that you showed off, what was that, a couple of weeks ago or last week? I can't even remember now. Recently, yeah. somewhat recently. Yeah. You've had him for a little while, though. I got the diver, too. Oh, that's that diver looks cool. You see, you had the Scuba Steve already from ChrisCon. Yes. <laughs> I didn't get any Scuba guys. <laughs> so I removed the neck collar. And so Moon Knight can look pretty much straight up with the hood on. Nice. Oh, and look who we have here from Facebook. So the cross streaming's working. How about that? We recognize that profile pic. What's up, Lost in Translation? How you doing? <laughs> Uh, Carrie, as one said, with Hasbro's Iron Man coming out, I'm still hoping for a Mafex War Machine. That'd be cool. Um, and Phoenix Force Moon Knight ripped off both of Iron Fist's arms. Oh my God. Man, comics are so cool. I have to, that's another line, another storyline I'm going to have to track down. That is epic. I mean, that's a, that's a good way of um, taking away his powers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Um, but guys, Machu, again, thank you, number one. For oh, yeah. hooking me Great. up with Goblin. Oh my God. And I'm so excited. So I, we've talked about it a lot. And, and I think, uh, you know, in our changing, you know, like how we enjoy toys, because that's what, that's what it's all about, right? Like all, everything that we do is enjoying toys, number one. And then all of the content and things that we do with them is, can be cyclical, can come, you know, ebbs and flows and all of that stuff. So, like, I know for me, I'm at a point. And I've kind of been there for a while now where if I'm going to do a toy photography shot, I want it to be, I want to go hard with it. I want to try to use all the things that I've learned over the last four years of, of, of doing it. Right. Mm -hmm. So, um, I was so like this, this set, cause I want to, you know, like, again, this, this is not the, the macho version. The macho version is still to me like the ultimate Spider-Man figure out there. Between the head rock, head sculpts, the cloth, like the 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 outfit on the Revil Tech body, but I you, really still like this figure a lot, man. It's so freaking good. I like the Spidey. I really do. What were you gonna say? I was gonna say if, if I find another 1.0, do you want me to do the swap for you? Yeah, you could charge me a customizing rate. That that would be okay. <laughs> That's fine. It's your time. I like. I, uh, but yeah, dude. I think that that would be. I gotta. Yeah, and next time I see you, I'm just mess. Ooh, if we do a do art studio trip this yeah. week, if we can figure that out and bring it, just so I can. I don't know just about this week because I'll be gone. Oh, that's right. Rats. Okay. Well, when when we do get that scheduled, um, that'll be a chance too to like mess around more in hand because like I mean, God, it's it's just looks so good but i this pleasantly surprised me the spidey with just how movable he is mm -hmm. and i know that some people talked about like you know some of the, the wear or crease of the yeah i didn't rotate the torso yet but i look at you still get a lot of crunch out of him oh yeah you do um so again like the vinyl and stuff like like i i'm not gonna mind number one i'm not like he's never gonna go anywhere like i want him forever so he's, he's another guy speaking of our joke from earlier in the show based on this look he deserves to sit in this chair oh man <laughs> it looks like goblin just put him in a timeout yeah right <laughs> yeah uh, like this is not spider-man this is just a kid on halloween trying to pick a fight with goblin be like yeah. listen i deal with the real spider-man <laughs> you're just a dude in hockey pads yeah but all right let's see if i can like the one thing that i right. still I never got say, i love him yes look at the uh the hands yeah it's like it reminds yeah. me of batman with his uh with his batarangs in his fist yeah Cape is great. The hood's a little tricky because the back of the hood has a little slit that you have mm -hmm. to like slide it over. 
Otherwise, it, it's very kind of janky. Uh-oh. Did but everybody freeze? Did I freeze? Machi, can you see me? I see you. Oh, okay. That looks but good. Yeah, this is this is cool. This has been in a box for like three months. <laughs> well, it's about time you cracked it open. See, this is the perfect reason to do it because we have just a fun little unboxing night. But look at that. Oh, yeah. I love Spidey is the one character. Matt, would you agree that like you just have mental Oh yeah. Like web swings that you're like, yep, there you go. But look how good he can move for like that actually mm -hmm. looks pretty good. The one thing I have to I haven't like come to terms with with my Mezco stuff is ever since I've tried to like upgrade my flight stands and like just overall editing like trying to really make sure that if i'm layering and like with a mezco there's still no real easy way of to getting play. these guys yeah yeah how would you how would you do web swinging with a mezco would you use the the arm the like the wrist i mean not the waist the waist uh clamps mm, or either the waist clamp or i try to well actually i poked a hole in mine <laughs> You Fair. know, okay. you should um, you should uh, send that picture of you poking a hole into your figure to uh, Mitchell Wu. Oh, he'd love like, it. I, I could also send it to to Toy Father and give him a heart attack. You already, I know. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> so yeah, he can he can move. He can really move. Um, I'm just a big fan of this guy. I will oh. also say that the hands for Moon Knight go on the peg easily yes so th that's what i heard <clears throat> like compared I, to say deadpool mm -hmm. it oh, which deadpool is, is tough difficult deadpool. like i'm afraid i'm gonna break it like i haven't changed his hands because of that <laughs> yeah and the head everything about swapping parts on my deadpool and i have the 2.0 and you have the 3.0 2.0 you sold the two oh wait do i have the original then i have the original no you have the 2.0 so which one did oh, we get? I think mine's the reissue of the 2.0. Okay, in the, in the black the box. The black box. Okay. Yeah, he's hard. Like just like, you know, like the way we talked about at ChrisCon, and, and I was like, <laughs> painful. I find Thor to be painful. a little painful too. Really? Well, his his helmet is uh, sharp, and his he has other sharp pieces on him too. Yeah. By the way, how cool is this addition? This was a great. I love that they threw this in here. Just a nice plastic rubber mm -hmm. symbol. I think that that was great. You you need to create that um that like toy mirth like bedroom, and that's that's the rug in your in the kids oh, room. Oh yeah, oh yeah. You need to recreate like that bluey bedroom. <laughs> that's that's the rug instead of the watermelon. Yeah, I, you know what? It's funny. I mean, I have a bedroom set up. It's from like you know, I've talked about it forever ago. But like, I made it from like a Michael's display thing, like a little studio apartment that like I've now designed. But yeah, that could go there. And then that's actually, you know what? I don't have the turtle rug. Um, and since you know, Mach is gonna blame me for Neca not being at a toy con, so we can get a sewer. Oh wait, but they weren't what? there. They weren't there. Oh. That wasn't my fault. Oh. Somebody other... wrote an angry email. No. <laughs> that was no, there was no anger. Oh, no. No, there was no anger. No anger whatsoever. It was a very, very sweetly worded email. No, no, no. You cut that out. Um, but oh, this man. could be, this could be a toddler turtle rug. That would be a cool rug for the toddler turtles. Yeah, there scene, you go. Right? Yeah, absolutely. Oh, is it, there's like one more hour left to, um, Shoot, I lost the hands. One more hour left for uh, Donnie's lab for those that want it. Man, I'm debating it. No, maybe not. There's just so much awesome. I mean, considering yeah. I just bought um, another Lone Wolf Dio. <laughs> if if I were if I would have been able to get the first one, yeah, Toy Con, I would have gotten Donnie's lab. But since I don't have the first piece, I don't need yeah. the second piece. Right. And that's not to say that we're never going to see a version of like, like not, a, not even a version. Like I'm sure Matt, we're going to both have an opportunity at a toy con one of these days, you know, like yeah. it's a matter of time. It's and like, we could play the waiting game now. Yeah. Um, I mean, you, you again at, at ours, you literally bought that Batmobile that was almost 10 years old, <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> maybe eight, you know, like, and you got a great, great price. 
Um, dude, all of these accessories, that was the big selling point, you know, when initially, but God, they really did just n nail it. And I was, it was funny. I think it was on, on Parallel on Tuesday was like, you know, Mezco could chill. No, Mezco should not chill on the accessories. I want all of their accessories all the time. <laughs> These are so great. This is my second Wait, web web mask from them. It is a lot. I mean, it is a lot. Some of the some of the webs. Yeah. Like, so this I I kept most of the webs in all honesty in um in the box because I have other you know wired ones. Webheads is like the guy that I've bought from. You make your own. D Blake makes great ones. This one I did take though. How? What is this one? You think, like, because of the two? What is this supposed to be for? It's wired and and bendy, really, it's a, it's a bendy web. So is this just? The only thing is, well, it has two web balls at the ends. So like, is this for like wrapping somebody up? You think? Yeah, I guess it's for wrapping somebody up. No, I didn't okay. use that because it's braided. Oh yeah, it's um, you know, but it's for him to um, it's his jump rope. Yeah, there you go jump rope all right i like that it's by you well, training. That, that's what's kind of interesting about like how i'm going to be using this spidey um i know i said it to you guys but it's it's kind of like how i view my hot toys like i'm not going to put him in extreme spidey t traditional posing but when i use him like he's just really pretty like I, you know you guys got to see my little preview of tomorrow's shot like like it's it wasn't in an action shot, you know. Like, and when I've seen most of our friends in the community post with him, it's very similar to that. Like, where it's him more in a static, looking at something, doing the thing. But I just really like owning him. I love the web shield that came out great. This backpack is better than the Mafex one. If we're gonna like compare yeah. web backpacks, you know. I would suggest that you try to get one of the head sculpts from from Henrock. Yeah, if he, yeah. If he has any left, Henry, and if in you the can, chat. he he was in the chat. I don't know if he's still there. Oh, he's asking for articulation tests on Spider Man. Can you use the two chairs and do a spidey split? A spidey split? All right. No, I'm do kidding. It. Don't do it. Just he can hit that split. Can he? He could. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, he moves really well. And you know what? Pick. Yeah, there it is. Boom. I could do it if I. I'll put the chairs. I'll, I'll and there's the no split. there's no double peach. <laughs> Just one big old <laughs> mezco hog. Yeah. <laughs> there you go, yeah. Yeah, that the thing I said. It's just that split chair. Every figure you own. Yeah. Spider Man. You do Deadpool. You do Wolverine. Um. By the way, so in my shot for tomorrow, I used the um the included Spidey Tingle, the Peter Tingle. Mm -hmm. So I ended up just blue tacking it to the back r rather than use the using the so, stands. Yeah. Um, I wish though. Speaking of Henrock, I have a great thing from him, Spidey Sense, that I would have. But I went all Mezco. Like I don't know if you saw that. I even included the Mezco pigeons. Like I wanted this to just be strictly. Oh, I'm going for it. <laughs> What's up? Is that what those pigeons were coming from? Yeah, no, yeah. Pablo that, just recently used one too. Yeah, like, and and apparently, because they were in the bodega box with a Gomez, like, there, that's it, <laughs> right, Matt? Like, I'm pretty sure that if I looked them up on eBay, like, <laughs> I didn't, I haven't checked, but I, I know people. How did you get your pigeons? In the bodega box. Okay, so you do have the bodega box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that. Mm. I still haven't opened my bodega box. Seriously? Yeah. Well, you'll get two pigeons. You get the flight one, and then you get the stat, like, just standing there, and it, they're, they're great. They're really yeah, awesome. They are, they are good. I've, um, seen, I've that, seen so many pictures with them. <laughs> yeah. I'm surprised you didn't bust it open just for that, to be perfectly honest, because the rest I, of the set is really cool, but... I do have doves. I have birds already that are flying. Oh, yeah. Okay. Let me see. I'll, it's I've used it in one shot. John Wick? No. Hmm. Was, uh, <laughs> no, this was the shot that I came number one in for TPC. Oh, never mind. <laughs> and here is a newspaper that he comes with, which is nice that it's actually plastic, but it doesn't. It looks great. Like that looks really awesome. And our boy Toy Father is going to drop a picture tomorrow in competition. <laughs> 
<laughs> friendly competition. <laughs> How pissed will you be if he gets it? And no, like, you know, uh, in all honesty, I you you know what my answer is always going to be. I am not going to be on Wednesday stream. I guess no, 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 no. <laughs> you, you, all right, hey, you're a Bluey fan, so any yeah. any and I and you know you know for those of you hanging out. I hopefully you know you you've had some bluey in your life and if not this is one of the best I'm not saying like if you don't kids around like it's not don't go out of your way to watch but it's really good like Chew and I love this show and you know what one of my favorite episodes and my kids too is past the parcel mm -hmm. and that is teaching them about right like like it's okay to lose and <laughs> Yeah, that whole that whole story. Actually, they they uh, Lucky's yeah. dad. My wife is like, "You're Lucky's dad. That would have been you." Like, well, they should have they should have squibs and uh, you know, like I'm changing the rules. And then it's like he can't handle it, and he's trying to give money to everybody. It's, it's such a good episode. Can everyone break a twenty? <laughs> <laughs> so no, one, my one that really depicts that though is um bum shuffle. That's a good one too. Yeah, but what I was gonna say is like so at the end of that episode, bingo has such a great character arc where over every single birthday party she just gets happy when when her friends are happy so that's that's how i like to live my life so no it's okay if chris wins it that'd be awesome i'm just playing. um you know no i know <laughs> but I, I i am this is like the first time that i'm i'm i've taken a picture in a while like mezco batman i did a couple that i was trying to like go for a, a mezco monday shot but like i you know just kept it to myself this one i'm like hey mezco i'm coming for you <laughs> let's do this <laughs> Uh, Bluey's also coming back. You know, going back to Bluey. I love um, Bluey, man. There's a special on the 14th, uh, 28 minute long episodes. Ooh. Called The Sign. It's um, spoilers. There's a wedding. Okay. All yeah. right. Um, what do you think of the, the camera? I thought the, the, the strap idea was really clever, but it's super tiny. I like the one from. Super action, uh, super action stuff. Better. Yeah. yeah. Oh, but yeah. Oh, it's a extra looking looking camera. It is. Yeah. The, like great paint work as always. It's just. It's just on the smaller ends. It's just yeah. small. But here we go, guys. Oh, baby. So those birds. I forgot what I got. So it, it was like a statue that I bought it with, right? And it comes with those birds, and they come with like a see, like a see-through piping, like a plastic okay. piping. Yeah. Basically, you can just Photoshop those out. But they come in like different states. Like, so there's one that's flapping its wings. Yeah. You know, there's one just soaring through the air. One looks like it's landing. That is awesome. Ooh, Henrock said my friend's favorite episode. All right, nice. Nice. <laughs> so tell him, tell him you know Lucky's dead. <laughs> uh, Messi said, uh, yeah, that Matt, that's a beautiful shot. So just so you know, guys, that that one, uh, that, that won a week of uh, top 10 TPC. over at the TPC. Yep. That was before the Toy Daddies even, right? That was yeah. well before. That was before they even <laughs> knew who a Yimbo was or a Chewy. <laughs> they absolutely had no idea who I was. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Messi says, trying to figure out an alleyway shot. Which fig should I use? Um, Aton's custom. Ooh, Mr. Knight, Gucci Moon one. Knight, Jada Fee Long. Or... Yeah. yeah. Here's my here's my thing. Go with both. Like, I love use both. Like, do like a dual like personality type shot mm. using both. Like, lead with I would lead with that Anton Custom one. Make him the focal point, but then have a sick Moon Knight pose to the side or back. Like the the, the duality of the characters. Oh yeah, if you can work in a, I, I know this is asking a lot, um, a reflective surface, you could insert. You know, Ooh. a Mr. Knight in the reflective surface, whether it's a puddle, a mirror, mm. a window. Look at you. Yeah, that's a good idea. I still haven't gotten into that reflection game yet. That's going to be that, that. Yeah, I got to try that out. And yes, Henrock has heads. Okay, perfect. Yes, my man. Nice. Ooh, Ease Animation Studio. Hello, hello. Thanks for joining us. This is a, an exceptionally long evening for us because I'm on spring break. So, um, yeah, we're just not an exceptionally the, long evening. You average about three hours when Machu shows up. That's true. Oh, don't blame me. <laughs> <laughs> it's all Machu's fault. I didn't join that at the 25 minute mark. <laughs> all right, we got to get this way. Driving. But, man, I. I I love this Spider-Man. I can't believe I 
I like slept on it. Not even slept on it. I, I I guess I was just avoiding my. I knew I wanted him. I don't know. I mean, I'm not sleeping on him either. I'm just making choices. Yeah, yeah. But I'm ha. Oh, I'm so happy. God damn it, Machu. <laughs> Do you have another? I have a. I think I have one more on the way. No. Do I have another one on the way? Yimbo, I think Yimbo claimed it though. That's okay. Let them yeah, let Yimbo have him. Wait, which one what did I claim? Oh, that guy. Healthy. Yeah. I do like their shields better than the uh I do like how Diamond has it connecting to the back though. Yes. I don't like how they connect to the yeah, back on this. You need that attachment hook. Yeah, it's a stupid, stupid way of doing it. Yeah. Other than that, figure's great. You should uh, tell me how you mod it and you're going to use a magnet. Well, the Mezco ones use magnets. Yeah. So. Oh. The balancing is going to be hard, but that's, there you go. He can do it. I, I won't be able, he's going to fall. Uh, There's no. Fish, you should do a fishing line later on, on just like the shoulder and just. <gasps> oh, there you go. I love it. a good balancer. Yes. <laughs> There you go, Henrock. <laughs> Henrock also joined us the other day. Was he, was he yesterday? Last yesterday. Night? Last yeah. night. I missed that one. I was um <laughs> half conscious. Yeah, half my, conscious. My face was like bright red from a cat. I was like, holy crap. I've never reacted that way before. By the way, that's the mask, but this is the only like Oh poop face! <laughs> I think I was trying to find a head sculpt that would work. <laughs> I love the way that mask should, came out. By the you way, you should do a training. This is like a tra training sequence for the heroes. Yes, and that mask could be on a one twelfth dartboard. And oh, that would be have cool. like little web shots hanging off of it. That would be neat. Yeah, both both masks were actually really well done in this set. Mm -hmm. Ooh, this could be your Rocky Rocky training series of uh pictures oh because you, you, know, you have a punching bag you got uh, yes stairs, oh my god you you need some stairs running through the city oh that would be neat oh you know what that's a great idea oh mm -hmm. crap because i've been looking i've been trying to think of a reason you know not just you know like i want i've been wanting to do like a like workout stuff because i i just you know I have, all, I have a whole gym i have a whole 112 gym of equipment now that could be the reason. There you go. And is yeah. that from Gridiron? No, this is from minibarbell.com. Oh, okay. I remember, yeah. And that those are neat. Hold on. So let's let's show those is, off for a is second. Is that exclusively a site just for 112? This is no, this is just a mini barbell. Like it's not even four toys. It, it <laughs> really <laughs> it's even got the knurling on the on the bar. Yeah. <laughs> That's cool. That is Excellent. I remember you showed that before. And it has the kilograms on the side, right? Like <laughs> it's in pounds, but they do or pounds, they, okay. They also offer it in kil uh in kilos, which is really cool too. But the way they they wrap it in like a tissue paper, but it comes with like the the weight stand. Oh my god. That's cool. <laughs> did so you see fun. um did you see Diggs picture this week of Dalsim trying to deadlift? Yes, with the arm. <laughs> Stretching. Did you see it, Jimmy, or no? I haven't. No. Oh my I, god. I love the use of the arms because there's now. no hole. There's no holes in that, so we put it over, like in front of the barbell, so it looked like it was. It was he was holding it, because the fists they don't come off. Okay. Oh wow! All right. So it's like. It... <laughs> there it is. <laughs> oh, that's, that's, that's awesome. <laughs> Well done. Well done. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, man. <laughs> wow, I can't believe I got Spidey to balance. I'm so... like Seriously, those chairs are really awesome. This, this, you, you can't use them because... Well, again, you can do some clever editing with um, the ankle cutout in terms of like using it in a scene. But like from behind, like they just really textured and nice. Yeah. But that's what we always know about Diamond stuff. Ah, oh. that looks good. And he's moving well. He moves pretty well for you. You're happy with him? Yeah, yeah, he moves really well. He looks really good. He, yeah, like he's 
He's definitely he. They made him. They gave him a little more meat. On his I was going to say, yeah, if you if you hold him up or if you want to lift him up again, um, he looks like way more textured uniform wise than like a traditional Mafex. Maybe I'm just because I'm used to getting comic figures from them. I don't think you've gotten the the, the MCU figures. on. No, this really, is this would be my really first one. If OK, like I have. I have the end game one right here. Oh, this is this is the part where Machu gets to make his toys all appear. Here we go. <laughs> no, because I have I have the three of them up there. Nice. Okay. So this one's missing a hand because the shield fell off. But oh wow, they really do. He look is good. he is a little beefier because they didn't put the bicep cut in. Mm. Oh wait, on the new one. Yeah. So this is the new one. But they took out the, the bicep. Why did they, they do that? They took out the bicep cut. You still get. You still get the range, okay, but like not as much, I guess. It really depends on how you pose them. Okay, you get it on the elbow. Oh, so okay, rotates around that way. Okay, yeah, it rotates there. Hmm. And then well, you... uh, it's more of like a it's it's more of like a uh, either a Figma or a Yamaguchi joint, closer to a Figma joint. Hmm. Okay, but the ankle articulation in the in the boot is better. Because I think this is a softer plastic, and okay. it, you can move it around better than this one. Because this is a little stiff. Oh, and it's but also it's still it's... better than the Infinity War one, which was really stiff. Okay, and that that cuff it doesn't look like it has the same cuffed a over the ankles that right on uh, the new one. It's a, the new one is a, it, it's more of like same... a boot. No, they still have a cuff. They both. Have oh. A cuff. Right. Okay. But the newer one, he moves pretty well in the ankle. Like, well, this is the boot swivel, but like okay. the ankle moves around really nice and stays oh, yeah. there. Right? Because I think it's on a double ball ball joint. Ooh. Right? Watch, I snap it. <laughs> Jimbo, you won't get that ever. The second one I got. <laughs> Well, I was gonna say, if there's one guy that could break a toy on a stream and and still feel okay, it would be you. <laughs> he's, he comes with just, two shields. He breaks the it and then repairs it on the same stream. <laughs> he comes with the 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 regular shield and then he comes with this the the, the, the blue shield. Yeah. yeah, the stealth shield. Oh, nice. Well, like okay. I love the way the light like refracts from the shield. Yeah. Yeah, that's a pretty that's a pretty color uh, scheme. It's a pretty color scheme. We end up buying that right now. <laughs> <laughs> it um, made me wonder why I even bothered buying the ha the Hasbro one, the uh, the Infinity Saga, like the one that you always see in Targets now. Yeah, yeah. But you wanted well, the head sculpt. Tar my, that's funny. My Target doesn't have that one. It has all the um, Mark II Iron Man's. Oh, so you're gonna get the Captain America soon? Yeah, it's just three pegs of just that yeah. one figure it's crazy i my target for the longest time um was yeah cap was iron man and the thor and then the spidey they came out but again on that old it's the old ugh, i didn't want it <laughs> so i was able to pass all those but again yeah. nice that they're putting those out for anybody now just starting because again there's so many new people that join the community there will every always day. be someone new so yeah it's it it's definitely a population that needs to have some of these figures available. Yeah. I can't believe the accessories that this set came with. Show me the frog. Where's the oh, frog? Yeah. The frog's the best one. <laughs> <laughs> it's so silly. It's so stupid. I love it. That is uh, it's so great. I mean, you could have so many good foes of just like the goblin throwing the frog at Spider-Man's head, being like, "What? Yeah, <laughs> why? Yeah. Why didn't this set off my tingle?" <laughs> <laughs> I also like that he came. You know, just tr traditional sense came with these like goblin battering type things, mm -hmm. and he has some like regular ones too, just for hand holding. What does um? All right, so this is the finger blast. Like that goes on one of the point pointed finger ones. Mm -hmm. Um, where did blast? Where did this? <laughs> oh God, words! What did <laughs> what did this part go to? Uh, that so that pegs into the back of the glider. 
Oh, nice. Okay. Yeah. The glider is freaking sick, by the way. So you can either peg that into the back of the glider or you can peg the stand. The arm stand. Oh, smart. Okay. And the other thing that was really cool, and Carlos had pointed this out, was that, yeah, to get the classic that you just were showing off before, that this this extends up. Yeah. And he really has excellent articulation. Like, I had to to get the... I think there's really only one way of kind of angling him down to get him to hold it as well, you know, like with that left arm. Yeah. But, um, like, it was... The, the legs moved up. This is a really great suit. It's a great suit. It yeah. really is. Like, the, the Aquaman I have... I thought it was going to feel like that, but it moves way better than the Aquaman. Again, just yeah. the, in terms of the improvement of the texture or the, you know, the clothing that they're getting. It is a material. Solid. Yeah. So I couldn't believe like really to get him down. Like it's, it's awesome. Oh, there's, there's a split, split Spidey. <laughs> um, KRS one said, Macho, do you have the zombie cat? I do. Yeah, yeah, I have that one too. Also, it's one of my one. favorite ones too. It's yeah. in a bin though. It comes out for Halloween, October. Yeah. I, that's where yeah. I bust out all my uh, superhero zombies. I bet it comes out when Giant Man. Comes I was about out. to say when Giant Man oh, comes out. Oh boy, they so uh, we doing... we got that one right, but not the scroll head. That was the scroll only head. one. So I was doing my taxes. Oh, we didn't get the was... scroll head. No, we were short by oh. a few hundred, I think. Yeah, it was close. It was very yeah. close. So when I was doing my taxes, I was like putting in the Haslabs. And I'm like, how many of these freaking giant men did I buy? How many did you buy? I think like I think like two or three. <laughs> <laughs> I was well, really trying to push that number up. Yeah. You were for for democracy. You were you doing your part. <laughs> on your live stream. <laughs> That's right. Like, you know, you could you could customize them to be a giant Chang Chi, and you're like you looked and then you bought them. I'm like, I I was joking. <laughs> like it, it would be. Cool. Oh yeah, I blamed you. That's I'm right. Like, that'd be That's really right. cool. <laughs> and I'm looking forward to it. I didn't think you would actually buy it. <laughs> like you already had two. And the... um, you know what? Again, there's going to be somebody that was on the yeah. fence that didn't pull the trigger. Now it's coming. Like actually, you're going to be able to. Actually, now that this classic wasp coming out. Yeah. People are going to want to complete that original team. Well, right. the thing is, is a lot of people pass on things, and then when they see other people getting a hand, they're like, oh, like the vamp. Yeah. Right. Yeah. The vamp is right. cool. The vamp is Very really cool. cool. Hey, I was happy to help out uh, Duart, man. That was great. Yeah. Oh, is that where your second one went? Yeah. Yeah. I just was just, boom, retail. Because, again, that's what we do. We, that's, you know, yeah. Everybody's got to do their own thing. I get it. Yeah. But over yeah. here, we try to help each other out. You both but after... Yeah. After pushing me to buy this 112 Batmobile, was like, "Oh, do you want my vamp too?" And I'm, <laughs> I don't have the space. You have a garage. Just I asked you about the vamp garage, first. You had right of your toys. You had right of first refusal. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but yeah, just, I'm I'm so excited about this these toys, guys. But what are you gonna say, Matt? I'm sorry. I'm still playing with 20. this guy too. I don't Spider-Man. think Yimbo opened that guy either. Yimbo, you gotta open up. I Final still have 20. to open him up too. I know. I'm going to. I, just, I, I love I, the ability to turn up the hip though with um, SH mm-hmm. because you move the butt cheek. You can get yeah. him up high. That's that's one of my complaints about the, the Mavex. Oh, you can't, the, can't. There's no right. hip. You yeah. Can't, there's no hip rotation. <clears throat> there is, but it's very it's very limited because of the and joint. Look high up. You can get. Ridiculously high up leg, if you want yeah. to. Yeah, you can still keep them. You know. And so what makes cool. me happy is that that's a Tom Holland that, I, again, I had two bum versions which I kept. I ended up keeping the second one, but of the um, the the battle, the final battle where he's all banged up. Like, whenever I start posing him in a web swing, like literally, he just pops off of that ball. Wait, so, really? Yeah, I remember I and then I bought one and I sent it back to Amazon and then I got the same issue. So I was just like, all right, I'll just suck it up because it's like I can do it, jet, but it's just not like you know when you have Spidey, you just want to, you know, crouch him yeah. into his stuff. And it was only until, um, I, it was too late for the one I had ordered 
or I got, I actually know no one wasn't even ordered. Matt, you got him for me from the pop up, but it was in that time frame with Gwen. You know, oh, yeah, yeah, broke. Yeah, that SH will replace those if you contact them and it's within six to nine months or so yeah. of when it first releases, so they have some in stock potentially. Uh... And that that will try to work something out with because it. you guys you guys said that that wasn't the case on right on yours Matt or Chris I think said it too right I, uh, I don't have that one so I think Chris yeah did you does it, yours doesn't pop off right which the, one the battle dude the battle suit because you have that one the final battle final battle the beat up Tom no way home yeah yeah, yeah I do I do I do have that one. but he doesn't, he doesn't he doesn't I wonder what my issue is with it it's it's almost like the peg is too small like i looked at like where it ports in and it doesn't seem like it's cracked or anything it just and like the fact that it was back to back i wonder if it's like a peg issue hmm. and that's the newer one right yeah because i have the infinity war one and i never had any issue and i still don't have any issues with him but yeah that other one i don't know it bummed me out, but like I said, I could live with it because it just means I had to be a little bit more careful with, uh, there we go. I do like the light up eyes. I know that it was like some people, you know, it's been hit or miss, but I, some like, people, that. I, I like, I like that. it. Yeah. Now, Machu, the, um, the light up eyes head doesn't, you can't get that to work on your, um, your custom, right? Or does no, it still work? Because, because it's not the same neck. Okay. I'm using the Yamaguchi neck on that. Hey, here's one. Here's one. It's not even. It's more of a question. And I guess it's it's just like any of these toy companies. Um, but the it bummed me out that I was about to try to use Peter Parker on the vapor body, but these heads have the pegs inside of them, all of them, just like the comic Superman. But then, like, it's frustrating when I want, like, I get ideas to do some body swaps with other mezcos and it's like oh i can't because you have pliers you can't i just need pli pliers. is it just pliers yeah okay well i'm being maybe low heat too though, i'm guessing i've just been anxious then about it okay i mean um, that's what i did with the superman remember I used all right so just Yamaguchi? yeah oh so it's just pliers. all right okay as long as they'll come out yeah you don't even need to heat them up oh really okay and there's the the split face. I still have the Legends one. That was a great head sculpt too. Actually, if you do heat it up and try to pull out the, the peg, you might risk bending. bending or... Yeah. Okay. Okay. Then I take it back. <laughs> All right. Then pl pliers. It is pliers. It is no big deal. Um. But yeah, I really like the light up feature. It was kind of a pain to work out for a second, but then. Like just to get the battery in, you know. <laughs> yeah. So, like with that, now any figure that has light up, like I mean, we got that first with Superman, but any figure like Cyclops, like if they were going to do a Cyclops, they don't need that stupid neck joint where it has the light up. Yeah, the Cyclops and my cable both have that right. light up neck peg, which mm -hmm. is terrifying because it doesn't have the Mezco pop when you pull it off. It's more of like a. Because it's a casing, yeah. it's like a yeah. different plastic. So, I mean, like, would they give us a new Cyclops with that feature? Probably. And like a new, like, I'm surprised they didn't use that for Ghost Rider because they used it for, they used it for Johnny Storm in the Fantastic Four. Like the head feature, it just the head is the one that lights up, mm -hmm. not the neck joint. Okay. Hmm. And what's you it do with you? Also, yeah. need to um just from this, you need to get um uh, Wolf to create a um principal's office for you. Right, that's where I was going with this. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> like you two are in trouble. <laughs> and that's what Aunt, I was thinking. And, and principal Aunt May. Yeah, <laughs> I was thinking about like that. That's the look of these guys in the chair getting yelled at right now. I love it. What are you knuckleheads doing in the hallways? <laughs> <laughs> Which one of you threw the frog? Yeah. <laughs> Actually, it looks more like parent teacher. Thing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Kairos what asks, do you guys own the Blitzway Voltron? Because my Voltron's chrome is peeling off. Really sucks. I do oh. not. I do not. My sister has that, though. 
And I think it's still in the box. Hmm. Oh, there's that Revil Tech Catwoman. Nice. There's a Revil Tech night right now with you guys. Jeez. Mm -hmm. This is one I do not own. Oh, I I highly recommend her. Yeah, I well that's why I'm I'm stoked that I yeah. I ordered her. She's in my. I have to I have to send the message to Speaking uh, of Rhea Ripley. Um, what night <laughs> do you think she's playing? She's um she's <laughs> she's on Sirius on the night. I don't know. Maybe Saturday. Because hmm. a lot of the main event title like. The title, the guys' titles are on on Sunday. Mm. Let's take a look. I'm gonna check out. Do the, they have the lineup yet? Let's see. Wrestle me. I feel like it came out. It, it, it went fast. The lead up to WrestleMania. Yeah, it's like already here. Yeah, like they add in like different cards. Like was it Friday? They they added a uh, Ray versus Dom tag match. Who's in the tag match? Uh, Dragon Lee and Andrade. So Dom and Andrade versus Ray and Dragon Lee. Oh. All right, here we go. So this is not, this is just the match card in, or in picks. So it's the Rock and Roman Reigns versus Cody Rhodes and Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins. All right, so this is not. Night. Yeah, oh. we need, we need like a night. Card rumors. Da, da, da. Night one matches. Okay, here we go. Cody Rhodes and Seth Rollins versus Rock and Roman Reigns. Um, that's all? That's all that's been what? That's night one. Night two. So these are the that's these are the only confirmed matches so far. You gotta be kidding me. Like uh, all right. So we have the tag confirmed. Okay, night two. Uh Roman what? Okay, well we know those are the confirmed days. The tag match right. on night and one. Then, and then, oh, that's right. Okay. Championship night two, but yes, we have the Ray versus Dom tag match. We have the six man, uh, six team ladder match. All right, so the these are without match. the confirmed date. So we who's, have um, Eo Sky versus Bailey. Who's going to have Hunter? Uh, Sammy. Zane. Oh, okay. All right, that's neat. Um, Rhea and Becky. All right, Logan Paul, Randy Orton, Kevin and Owens. Jay versus Jimmy. Uh, Judgment Day versus DIY versus New Day versus oh New Day's back. Um, Awesome Truth, Eight Down Down, New Catch Republic. That's cool. Six Pack Ladder Match. That's going to be brutal. Um, LA Knight versus AJ Styles. Yeah, so that's the only stuff that's actually confirmed. And then I it, guess um, I think there's a um, three versus three against um, Damage Control. Okay. So I think it's uh, Bianca Belair. I think maybe Jade Cargo and Naomi versus um, the rest of uh, um, Damage Control. Isn't that crazy, though, that they, they still, we still don't know? Yeah. That's nuts. That's on our toes. Yeah. Ugh. Only if only that's four matches. I suspect Jay versus Jimmy is on night one. Yeah, I think so, too. That's oh, I was—I thought I was sharing the tab. That's so funny. I thought I was scrolling the stuff with you, but okay, never mind. <laughs> none of these tab. This was none of it was worthwhile. I'm just I talking over you. Man, if that's the case, you're like, why does he keep talking? I have the list in front of me. No, 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 no. That was—I was looking at the. My bad. I thought I had it up that I was scrolling with you guys. Um, let's see. Ender says, "I'm still waiting for the Revil Tech Ninja Gaiden pre-order to pop up somewhere." Ooh, that could be a cool figure too. Yeah, that is. That they showed the the prototype for that maybe a couple months ago, I think. Um, did you guys? Oh, here's Toy Arc. Here we go. No, not gonna. Oh, all right. oh, there we go. Are you sharing your screen? Oh, oh, yeah. Now I am. Now I am. Oh boy. All right. I just want to make sure I had the right one. Boom. So here's Toy Arc. That could be Ooh. cool. That could be really cool. Yeah, that looks fun. Neat. And then... Although that's a digital. Ones. I, I want to see... Like, yeah, that. right. But we know what we're getting. Like Even then, we, no, we kind of know what true. we're getting with them. So wait, they're doing some Street Fighter figures? Yep. What? 
Old mm-hmm. man, there's another Everybody's... old man Ryu. So, uh, is this uh, like a, a Yumbo Street Fighter? <laughs> <laughs> Next time you gotta show up in like a gi and a headband. <laughs> like, all right, all right. I will say my pecs are not that large or defined. <laughs> I'll allow it. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Oh boy! But yeah, well, if, if yeah, if Revel Tech's now doing Street Fighter, is Storm gonna lose that license too? Have they done anything lately? With I guess who was the last one? Balrog, or did they have anybody after Balrog? Evil Ryu. Blanca and Mark Ryu oh Blanca's something. coming out. That's right. Blanca looks great. Or no, I was thinking. I'm hey, thinking Long. of the SHF that looks great. Hmm. Right, he had the bug out eyes. You know what I imagine the MK issue SHF? for a storm? Yeah, is that they're exclusive through Big Bad now. Yeah, yeah, they've always. I think they've always been, haven't they? No, no, that was it... direct as well, and other sites like Amazon, you could get a bunch of them. Mm-hmm. But yeah, that was uh, Balrog was the first one, right? I remember the Amazing announced that. I think that that was like uh, the first exclusive. That Zangief. I mean, there's still a few. That I would be I interested in, he, yeah. Does he like? How would he blend with uh, str- like the I mean, the Jada? He's an, he's an oversized guy, so he fits in pretty well, right? Like, I feel like he'd probably do pretty well in a another one against I the Sagat. Sagat is another yeah. one because he's like de- depending on which Street Fighter you're, you know, which media you're um, looking at, he can be like. A, maybe a couple feet taller than Ryu, or mm-hmm. he could be the size of a house. Right. Oh, man. Well, there's always more toys for us to discuss, but we've been going long, and, you know, the three of us can continue to oh, that hits chit-chat. That's like good. Yeah. Oh, she's got the movable eyes, too. Oh, really? Yeah. Mm. Hmm. That is oh the movable eyes just like Harley. That's awesome, and Buzz and Woody. <laughs> oh, that's good. All right, I'm so excited. I got I got to con- I got to contact Hobby Yankee about shipping her out because I'm very excited to get my hands on her in a toy posing sense. <laughs> um, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I think I think. <laughs> Again, we've, we've had a nice little long hangout tonight, so I think we can like wrap things up on the stream, and then the three of us can keep chit chatting uh, afterwards. But guys, thank you so much, right? Unless unless you guys have anything else you want to no, get into tomorrow. right now. I mean, we we are still going to. <laughs> <laughs> what, um, Chewy, do you have the? Do you have any of the Mafex Batman? I have, yeah, I have the Hush uh, Blue version. Yeah. Yep. And I have Nightwing. And that's it. So she'd go perfectly. So you didn't order her? I'm surprised. To my figures, man. Fair, fair. I'm, try- I'm trying to try. We keep saying we keep saying we're trying. As long as we're under the hundred, that's that's the that's. The- <laughs> I mean, I feel like we've we've made some damage this past month. So we we have. That's for sure. Oh, look yeah. at them! Go, look at them together. They look pretty good. Yeah, they do. I hope the blue the blue would look good with her too, because that that'll get me using him again too. You want me to get the blue one? I have the blue ones in a box right there. Well, if you want to, it's up to you. I mean, you're trying to end the show, so. (laughs) Well, I just figured, you know, we've we've been hanging out for a long time again, guys. Thank you so much for you gentlemen for happy Easter to you too, fellow young. Oh yeah, what's going on, Boomer? How you doing, seventy eight? Boomer. Um, Captain Boomer. Captain Boomer, yeah, but uh. I know we went a little long for for, for you know because Yimbo's. I don't have to work tomorrow, and I don't have to talk to myself in the third person. <laughs> Damn you, ending. <laughs> stay, stay. <laughs> All right, I'll go get Batman. I'll be right back. Go get great Batman. Okay. Great Batman. Um. So yeah, we we. Do we, I need Catwoman? I think you do personally, because that's that was like an immediate. You know, we don't have very many good. I mean, I personally don't have a lot of awesome six inch scale dc figures and again in in the batman world just like i bought the reason i bought tombstone is because he's a awesome spider-man rogue like i wanted 
So like any kind of when, a connection to those type of characters. Selena Kyle, man, she's awesome. I'll, I'll, I'll think about it. I'll think about it. The two fact that figures. two main good figures. That's true. That is true. But you also have two really good figures that would go with her with mm -hmm. Nightwing and Bats. I had to make choices. I also didn't did not pre order Agent Venom. I skipped on Agent Venom as well. As cool as he looked, um, my, you know what? What's sad that my deci decision point was um, finally made was that because of all his spikes, mm -hmm. I figured it really it'd be kind of painful to swap all his parts. I'm just like I can't do it. I can't. I I don't. I've been scarred in the past by Mythics to be like this really hurts to play with this figure. Yeah, <laughs> but that that factors in. Uh, that factors into the enjoyment. <laughs> I think Thor has some like spiked cuffs. I'm like this. It's really sharp. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> all right, we got the. Uh, broken. <laughs> what do I mean? Let's see. No, no, no. We're, no we're we're just, I'm just trying to enable Chewie into getting Catwoman. We're talking about you. <laughs> I dropped my headset. That's what I dropped. Not Batman. That's why I said when I we heard the little bit of a, a drop, I'm like, oh, oh no, if I broken. dropped Batman, you would have seen me freak out. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, oh, it's broken <laughs> forever. Then I look in directly to the camera. Um, so about Batman. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You, you completely turn around. It's like uh, the blue one sucks. Uh, the black the one's better. One <laughs> no one wants the blue one as you throw <laughs> the body behind you. <laughs> oh, they look good. I love this. See, that's why I went with the blue and gray first. There we go. They do look good together. They do. I mean, I love the uh, black and gray looks too good too. But look at that. Yeah, pretty, pretty. Nice. I'm into it. I'm into it. No, I'm not doing it. You I say might, that now. I might do you it. say that now. You well, right now, now I'm looking. I'm thinking about Stealth Cap and Catwoman. I'm like, geez. I know. Uh, so, speaking of Stealth Cap, uh, Bucky's going to be released later this month. Oh, I don't have that Bucky? Bucky. I have the uh, um, Revel Tech Bucky orders. Oh, I mean, you okay. always have more than one. Yeah, that's true. That's, that's more <laughs> of a comic Bucky. This the is year I get two Buckies. Yeah. Uh, imagine how good she'll move. Another enabler. <laughs> Damn it, <somebody. laughs> you know what's funny because I, he has that great custom Catwoman too. Well, with you, I you uh, you, you or I kind of know which direction. I think Matt, you you get the sense too of which ones Chewie would like. He's just mm -hmm. trying to lie to himself, and I feel mm -hmm. like this is one of those. So just like you know, just rip off the bandaid. It's, it's gonna you're gonna. <laughs> Yeah, I, uh, I don't... myself every day. It's like, no, you don't need to go work out today. It was a hard day. You know what would be good? Cake. Yeah. <laughs> For me, it's a chip witch or ice cream sandwiches. I love no, it. It's, it's like, you know, there's some Tillamook ice cream, vanilla, <laughs> and Oreo cone. Enjoy. This is for 78. <laughs> We'll give it a bloop. There you go. <laughs> and she does, in fact, move very well. <laughs> That's some Kathy Ireland action right there, 78. <laughs> Boom. Pay double. <laughs> I Too wish much. I had the little martini glass, like the, oh, like the Mezco the comes with, and then I could just let it sit there. Yeah. Oh, my God. Do you have? Oh. It's not around the, me though. It's the and Christmas, that, the Christmas that's your Gomez next million dollar reel right there. Yeah, million view reel. <laughs> million view Matt with the yes, do it. The martini glass. Do you have that? Um, the yeah, Christmas I Gomez. Do. I do because it was I in do. the it was in the what's it called the what's the radio called the boombox? No, yeah, what's it called? It was in the advent calendar. Yeah. No. It was in the holiday Gomez, yeah. The holiday Gomez, but like, yeah, in the because the case opened up with like the tonic or the liquor or the vodka, yeah. and then the the glass, yeah, the martini glass. That would be a cool shot. That would be neat. <laughs> um. So yeah, this has been a blast. This has been so great. Thank you, everybody that's hung out this whole time. We we appreciate you. Obviously, you've been watching live again. Thank you so much for the comments, for the chats. 
uh, and just, you know, for, for hanging out with us and enjoying us, uh, you know, hopefully listening to us talk about toys. We appreciate you guys greatly. Thank you so much. Um, and if you're catching the replay, I hope uh, you've en been enjoying presumably your Monday or whatever work day that you happen to be listening to this <laughs> throughout to hopefully make your day a little bit better. Um because, yeah, this is just uh, all about love and toys and all of that good stuff. And, of course, friendship. Um, 78, glad I joined. The cake was great. <laughs> and one last plug for this Wednesday. If you, um, right after you, um, uh, between two Sentinels on TPC Top 10 with the Toy Daddies, you'll be able to enjoy an evening where we have special guest Emily from the G.I. Joe team joining us going to be so exciting and hey, do you have a guest up yes we have brick something oh, oh nice. yes, Spiro. yeah oh, that's Spiro. right Spiro. Spiro. Cool. so oh so good so good so they, they continue to crush it i think last i saw was like 225 towards this kickstarter so they've like blown away their goal at this point i'm pretty mm -hmm. sure yep but now they're unlocking a bunch of cool cool stuff Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, the Spiro World Tour continues. Uh, so Wednesday night, again, between two Sentinels, 8 p.m. The TPC Top 10 at 8.45. And you know what? I'm on break, so my, I'm, I'm, maybe we could... You might you know, be doing some streams. Extra streams, you know, to make sure for all of our channels to hit that notification bell and uh, make sure you're subbed, all of that good stuff. And again, we appreciate you guys. You're the best. Messy, here we go. Should I get Holiday Gomez? I love that figure. Is this still available? I think it came back around. <clears throat> if you could join a wait list or get it for, you know, around the retail price, man. I think the wait list is still available, at least. I think I remember seeing that. And then a lot of people have been posting it. So. <laughs> Map her away. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> messy i think you should get the uh cat woman yeah yeah do that instead that would that's a good call that's a good call what do you say yep epic all in draft to it <laughs> yeah chris turned me down it's like let's do an epic all in and then we draft figures yeah. and slowly become more miserable as the night goes through <laughs> <laughs> yeah i'm surprised he didn't go for the epic all in he does have a cat lair coming this year. He's probably That's just true. thinking. I have a dragonfly, three giant men, <laughs> a, a ghost. partridge, and a pear tree. Yeah. The ghost coming in also. The ghost is coming the in. Ghost. Oh my god, I keep forgetting about that. And my ghost trap oh, and the uh, hell PKE. Of ghost. Well, we better go before uh, all of us yep. spend more money. So. <laughs> Thank you guys for everything. Have an awesome rest of your night. Check us out on Wednesday. Hit that notification bell. Videos you know, galore will be coming. And we'll see you soon. Peace.